Welcome back. We rejoin our protagonists, having finally succeeded in gathering all three of the Black Books to Eroy's Vault. And, uh, especially since I forgot to do it at the end of last session, uh, now we are going to do some level ups. So, uh, first off, let's do Einar. Oh, why'd you have to pick me? I'm probably the least prepared for this. <laughs> Everyone wants to do Einar, let's be real. Einar, how right. um, uh, Can't comment. Uh, <laughs> I don't know what I want to pick. All right, so you're leveling up to Thanks level 12 in Cleric. Yes, yep. and I'm going, I'm going to choose a... Uh, Trey! Will. Uh-uh. <laughs> you take your three. What are you talking about? Was that not you? No! Oh. Who oh, was you that? actually thought that was me? Yeah, I okay, can't then see you don't get to over there. <laughs> I, genuinely, I thought you were doing a blame the person who obviously didn't do it. No! To which you would have taken three damage. Anyway, no, Will pushed the screen of his laptop back and it knocked over his water bottle. Oh, I had no idea. I had an idea. All right, uh, feet or ability score improvement. Did you say feet? No, uh, I'm, doing, I'm doing a yes, feet. Yes, a feature. Okay. I was getting two new feet. Man, what's wrong with the old feet? Mm, well, yeah, we'll they, they've, they've had a lot of mileage on them at this point. Mm, Got to rotate them. Yep. <laughs> Got to swap them out. Y'all test me. <laughs> Are you failing or are you passing the test? <laughs> yeah, I'm beginning to be sorry, Trey. <laughs> I'm all of a sudden... So glad Will doesn't play Sea of Thieves. <laughs> oh, no. Yep. Look, honestly, that would be a great time. It would, but also... You think slapping skellies is a problem. <sighs> All right, Einar, you are taking a feature. Mm-hmm. Uh, do you have any idea what yet? <laughs> I know. All right, well, I'm looking through you look them. through Something and we'll... Makes you... Ooh, Sentinel. Uh, I was thinking about maybe, like, doing... Um... What was it was it Warcaster that gives me advantage on uh, yes. charisma saving throw or not charisma uh, constitution, constitution saving, saving throws and make to keep uh, concentration and from oh. my I don't remember you uh, casting log concentration spells. Well, well, shield, shield of faith cast shield of faith is oh, okay. concentration it also allows you to cast um, spells as a uh, opportunity attack oh and you can do it with a shield nice. in hand too. Which technically oh. I should being that I've always had a shield I should probably take that. Yeah, um, just for, for the just for the fact of like retroactive. <laughs> Wait a second, but, um, I can take that now too with Ray. Mm -hmm. Oh my gosh, are we all gonna have shields? That would yep. be that would be cool. Shield bros. Yo, oh we what is being no. Spartans? Strategic shield homeland wall. intervention. What is it called? Strategic homeland intervention Dang. enforcement and logistics division. Yeah. Oh, sorry. I was going. With, I was going with something completely different. Yeah. Uh, All right. So we'll see who picks up on that. <laughs> what? Next time, I'll... Um, I need to roll my health. Where is my D eight? Homeland intervention team. Shit. <laughs> 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 Oh my gosh, that was great. Try just look it up. Three seconds, and then the realization hits. Oh, that was beautiful. Noah, what I roll? 12. Damn right. right! That's my health. Um, that's not what the warlock rolls. Isn't it war? Well, it's artificer, right? Or, oh no, he's, that's right. he's doing it for Kudo right now. Shoot, Why are you right. rolling a d12? Never mind. It's d8, right? He's trying to so. cheat. Even a fighter is still a d10. Oh, it is? Yep. Barbarian. Barbarian's the only oh, one that's man. a d12. I want to play yeah. So, don't roll it yet, though. Because we're doing that. So, oh, and in addition, uh, Noah, go ahead and roll a d... Oh, right. d8? d10? Right, we... we um, I think d8. d8, yeah. For so, you got one? Yeah. Uh, you know, oh sorry. You know, I I shouldn't roll with his dice because this is Einar. I have yeah. to use. The oh yeah, use Einar's dice. dice. This is a level up. This is the, important. The dark. That is true. <laughs> Correction: the dice are the background singers. <laughs> the choir. <laughs> Sound like the, you said squire. The pedestrians. 
the, the music video. That sounds like an actual band, the Pedestrians. <laughs> All right. All right, I'm done. Okay, I'm done with this no adventure stuff. I'm gonna start a band. For that. Couple Three. of people. I'm sorry. So it's a four, four. five plus whatever. Crossing. Well, no, it's it's you add on D and Dawn. You just add the number you rolled. It yeah. automatically adds your constitution. Okay. Yeah. Do you not do the middle of the road rule? Nope. <gasps> you reroll ones and twos, but otherwise that's it. That hurts my heart. Yep. It and my it. health. All right. <laughs> we're we're gonna. <laughs> Having a D12 is a lot less fun when you roll threes um, all the time. <laughs> yeah. Okay, so oppor- for the opportunity attack thing for um, Warcaster. Yep. Um, does that include, like, Toll the Dead and stuff like that? It uh, targets let me them, just but it's double a saving check. throw. Uh, uh, it says, rather than making an opportunity attack, blah, blah, blah. Uh, yeah, the, um, you can do Toll the Dead. Okay, cool. Ooh, I like that. Yep. I will, I will take Warcaster... Mostly for the sole purpose of I've had a shield the whole time, and technically I should be taking it off for um, somatic components. Uh, well, to a degree, so long as you have a free hand, and I've considered the whip to be non-intrusive into your ability to cast spells. Okay. So, yeah. Okay. Well, we'll, we'll say for now that's what I'm choosing. Yeah. But no, that's, if, that's totally well, fine. We can, I'll keep looking at stuff. Mine's you, very uh, simple. Talk to the other yeah. guys. Well, I've got, I've got the list up here. All right, so Keen. Yes. Hello. Uh, you're going to be leveling up. I assume just taking another yeah. level in Sorcerer. She's very keen yes. to do that. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> so go ahead and roll Thank your... You. Thank you. Uh, D6. Mm-hmm. Oof, that hurts. For your health. Yep. Sorry. Oh, that was a lot of dice. That is a three. Three? All right. Middle of the road. And then uh, you also get a ability score improvement or a feature. Is there something in particular you have in mind? No, probably just uh, ability score stuff. Okay. Cool. Kudo! You're taking a level in Warlock. Yes. All right, roll your D8. What a shock. Sit up. I got it. Oh! You okay. reroll ones and twos. Who's that? It's a one again. Oh my gosh. <laughs> just sit up. <laughs> yes, maybe it stop dropping sense. it and like <laughs> actually roll. Sense your. Says the guy who went dunk last day, last session. I do remember that roll. Hey, six. Six? All right. And then. Oh. Uh, so you're. Do you get. What are you getting with that level? Uh, I'm taking a feat. Nice. I don't know the feet yet, though. Okay, fair enough. I don't well, know you only have two choices right, right that bit beaten by half a damn second. Sir. <laughs> and Riss, are you taking a level in Ranger or in Rogue? I do believe I shall be taking a level in Rogue. All right. Rogue. So go ahead and ah, roll your D8. Mm. It's a re-roll. Seven. Nice. nice. Hot diggity dog. One more than me. All right, and what do you get at... This makes you level 7 in Rogue? Yep. I get Evasion. Nice. Evasion's a very good feature. Evasion. Indeed. Okay. And Ranger got nothing, so that's why I took Rogue. Fair enough. What? No, I don't want to say hi to Grandma. What was that? I don't know. It was Ryan's girlfriend calling him. Yeah, right. (laughs) I <laughs> So We return All of you have taken a long rest As a Keen Well that's actually uh, No kudo you're the only one who has to figure out what feat you're taking Yeah So Come on well, kudo. I might also I'm really Oh you're not thinking, going forecaster? I'm well shield master sounds uh, pretty cool too. Because, I love shield master. Um, if you aren't incapacitated, you add your shield's AC bonus to any dexterity saving throw you make against a spell or other harmful effect that targets only you. And then, if you are subject to um, an effect that allows you to make a dexterity saving throw to take only half damage, you can use your reaction to take no damage. And if you uh, if you succeed the saving throw, so. It's, it's a very nice one. It sounds very nice. The only issue is that Einar's not very dexterous. 
No, you're not maximizing so. on it, but it's a nice help. You know, because if you think about it, you have a plus four right shield right now. So, like, sure, you're not dexterous, but that changes yeah. it from what, a minus one to a plus three. So No, I don't I think, think it's, it's a plus four I, shield. I, I think it's just a... Well, no, no, no. So it's like a plus two shield, I think. And so it's no, plus... No, his shield is just the... Uh, I still have the Forest Kingdom one. Yeah, just a plus one. So it's a, a total is, of a plus three. Re- remind me... But it is no longer a depiction of the Forest Kingdom. It's because I can change the image. Yeah, you can change the model. image, and so you yeah. change it to... Um, I believe I change it to the image of a lion. Yep. Black the lion. obsidian lion. Oh, right. So I just found out... I just found a way to do a minimum of uh, 18 damage. <laughs> I eat. <laughs> Sweet. Yeah. That's nice. That's good. So, as you finish up uh, those last decisions... We return as you all wake up, having finished a long rest, and you take your shenanigans damage. Yep. Which is mm. two for Ryan, one for Noah, and one for Will. Yep. Because <laughs> I rolled minimum for all y'all. Uh, you are in the Wandering Shadow. Hmm. What do you do? Riss, not are we in separate rooms? I assume like we all were just in each other's rooms, right? I yeah, so. I believe you all got separate rooms. Riss will wake up and wait for the others to wake up. He because he does not know how it works. He doesn't know if he died before everyone because he turned a worm. <laughs> <laughs> I think Einar is just gonna assume that everyone's back. He's like, oh, I'm I'm awake. I'm. Okay, I guess it's over. And he's going to exit his room and he's I guess I guess we'll roll the dice of who's directly across the hall from him. Sure. Um, roll a roll a d6. Guess, oh, yeah, d6. hang on. Hang on, Trey. So remember how Kudo woke up in Einar's room last time? Yeah, that was weird. Yeah. So I, I rolled a d20 to see if it happened again if it was an, if it was under a 10. <laughs> He stayed in his own room. If it was over 10, he woke up in Einar's room. It was an 18 on the die. Mm-hmm. So Einar. <laughs> so Einar wakes up, and Kudu's at the foot of his bed. Einar wakes up, looks at Kudu, goes, Uh, you know what? This, I feel like this isn't out of the ordinary. Kudo's Good morning, still Kudo. Kudo's still asleep. <clears throat> Einar's, gonna, <laughs> Einar's gonna lean in to Kudo's ear. Morning, Kudo. <laughs> make, make an intimidation check. <laughs> intimidation. Interesting. Please, net 20. It's an eight. Uh, eight plus... I do have a modifier for that. Uh, so 12. 12. Okay, yeah. It's just... It's slightly just like... <clears throat> mm, like, just a little bit unnerving, but it's not like... Ugh. Kudos. Mm. Why are you in my room? I don't know. Kudo, you've got to get that checked out. And I <laughs> smacks him on the back, gets up and leaves. Yeah. Wow, that was one hell of a dream. Oh, man. <laughs> All right. So, one, two, Kudo's room is right across, and I know will barge into an empty room. Uh, three to four, it's Riss. Five to six, it's Keen. Yep. Yes! Einar kicks the door in, sees the empty room, goes, ah, turns around, grabs Kudo by, like, the collar, drags him into the room, doesn't even, like, drag him far enough for him to get, like, into bed. He just drags him across the threshold and drops him. You ain't a morning person, are you? Oh, on the contrary. I love the morning. Mm. Just not you. I I don't love you either. Good. We will remain friends. What benefits? I I don't like that that tone. (laughs) (laughs) Kudo goes. Acceptable. Understood. Then he gets in bed. (laughs) You're just getting back in bed. I'm just gonna hang out there for a second. All right. Segment. From where Einar said he drug 
Kudo by the call. He drugged. He didn't he drugged drugged. Him. We're not having a Bill Cosby incident here. Don't worry. From his room. Sir. <laughs> oh, no. From his room. And all they talked about was not being anything more than just friends. <laughs> and how Kudo got back into bed. <laughs> I just need that segment only. Hang on, roll a roll a perception check. I think it would be insight. No, <laughs> this isn't. This is perception. I'm really scared to see what we're perceiving. You don't notice anything. Uh, with a oh no, perception I'm not as good at. So yeah, probably not. It's no. only a nine. No, it's wait. Uh, Twelve. No, yeah, you don't see anything. Okay. <laughs> All right, <laughs> Riss. And Keen, what are y'all doing? Do we all wake up at the same time? Is this clear? Uh, give or take, yeah. Okay. Is you it, both just hear a boom <laughs> as a door is kicked in down the hall. <laughs> Wrist will exit his room and see on and go, did we get it? I don't know. <laughs> I, that Who? is. I, so you, we all You died? don't know? I died. That's why. I, I got. Eaten and then oh, I remembered uh, just nothingness, and then I woke <laughs> up. That's I, why I, I got back into bed to summon the book and see if I have it. You do. All right, I put it away. <laughs> All right, and Keen. Um, take my time. Getting out of my room. I, I can probably hear all of your conversation oh, nice and loud, loud and clear right outside. Pretty much. Oh, yeah. So, yes. I don't think the door is yeah. a very good insulation. No. Uh, actually, <laughs> they, they probably would yeah. have really good insulation. <laughs> so, like, you heard, you both would have heard the massive thump of a door being kicked in, but other than that, nothing much. Hmm. Interesting. Okay. So Keen is just kind of taking her time. Yep. And finally coming out to see what is going on. All right. Which and is, I guess, just Riss and Einar standing in the hallway, staring at each other, dumbfounded, thinking that the the other person had the book. Yep. <laughs> All right. Kudo's going to get up out of bed. <clears throat> He's going to stretch. <clears throat> I don't ever want to have that dream again. Damn it. <clears throat> and he'll walk out into the hallway. He'll walk by those two, pat Einar on the back, and go, all right, let's go get breakfast. I got your damn book. Come on. Well, that's good news. I suppose that Thanks solves it. Thanks for the confirmation. It. Breakfast it is. <clears throat> I want good to me. bacon. You two always I want can bacon. Pancakes, bacon, bacon, pancakes. <clears throat> and that's why we're friends. <laughs> the wrist is rolling. <laughs> <laughs> I was trying to make a solid reply to him, but I, I couldn't help but laugh. Chris is rolling inside on that. <laughs> Keen just rolled a flat twenty on insight. Oh, I'm I'm messing with him hardcore right now. You there, see, uh, you sense confusion in Einar <laughs> and amusement in the Kudo. Yeah, Fair. same. Ooh. <laughs> you know, you know what's great though. I I don't think Einar is honestly confused. I think he's at the level where he like, like it just passes over his head so completely that he's just like, yeah, we're friends. Cool. <laughs> <laughs> this is the man that I'm pretty sure didn't realize someone was intending to bed him until he got into the room. So yes. that makes sense. <laughs> <laughs> Which one was no. that again? On the train. On the train. Oh, okay. <laughs> Well, he's he like, well, he's know. walking around. Oh, look, look, I got a new friend. Oh, I got a new friend. No, no, <laughs> I fi- Einar figured it out during the card game. Yeah, that's but it was, it was only after several comments were made. <laughs> yeah, he was like, oh, yeah. that's where this is going. Because keep in mind, okay. even on the train, Einar made a new friend. <laughs> Indeed. Correct. You notice Sulan uh, sitting at the bar. Uh, enjoying a what appears to be a cup of tea. Mm. A sophisticated man. Kudos going to go <clears throat> like half groggy. I'll have what he's having. Are you sure about that? Yeah, it's early in the morning. I, I just need something that'll wake me up. <clears throat> Inside. 
if you wish. Can I make a perception check on what? You what can make an teeth? insight check. Yeah, Verissa's okay, rolling Vris Vris roll for insight. Oh, natural 20. Oh! Very nice. Kudo's not rolling. He just wants a drink. Einar's too too far asleep. That's only a... Whatever's in that, in that cup is not tea. <laughs> Riss will walk up to the bar after he places the order. Lean over, slide a gold coin and say, whatever it is, make sure it's stronger. <laughs> the kettle is poured and a not delicate but a you know a, a nice teacup is put in front of you mm-hmm. take a sip not yet okay I'm gonna hold it in front of me for a second yep there's and a little nice steam it. coming off of it mm-hmm. you have to brood over your <clears throat> you breathe and your sinuses are cleared holy shit <clears throat> I want some of that oh well, that woke, damn, that really woke me up. <laughs> Whew. The hell is this? Take a sip. <laughs> Sulan just <laughs> casually does so himself. <gasps> you got any bacon back there, dang. And he'll uh, he'll take a sip. Make a constitution saving throw. Oh, of course. <laughs> Holy. Six. Um. Oh, this is wonderful. You know how... It's a sip. Oh, oh, I know. Doesn't matter much. <laughs> <laughs> it's not alcohol. It's more akin to... You know how um, chewing tobacco, when it has like fiberglass shards, like cuts yes. your mouth a little and it gets straight to the bloodstream? Yes. This is some kind of like spiced... You could technically define it as tea, but, it, like, imagine the only thing I can compare it to is imagine making tea out of tobacco leaves. <laughs> it doesn't taste very good. Ah, okay. But it's strong. But you take a sip. Your eyes go a little bit wide. Immediately alert. You are wide awake. <laughs> it's not like a caffeine. It's not like adrenaline. You are just... Any ounce of sleepiness, you were just... That's some go-go juice right there. A little bit, yeah. <laughs> so long, it's just <clears throat> casually... Mother of <laughs> God. Sipping. Rest over here sipping his tea, too. <laughs> just like, Did you my order head some? No. <laughs> <laughs> Kudo, Kudo goes... Oh! <sighs> Damn. Indeed. <laughs> I have a taste for the finer things. I wouldn't call that fine. I'd call that holy shit juice. <laughs> What's the difference? Yeah, yeah apparently nothing. Uh, can I get like a regular drink, please? Damn. I did ask you if you were sure. I was sure. I'm awake now. Thank you. <laughs> Salon nods towards the... <laughs> Where's that bacon? <laughs> I need to cleanse my palate. You do uh, rest. <laughs> well, and I can roll for deception if you would like. We'll hold up another gold coin and wink at the bartender. I'm, I'm perception on that one. You already rolled. You already rolled. Actually, no, no, no. That wasn't for you. Roll a perception check. I'm looking for better die. <laughs> okay. And add five in Ooh. addition to your fire. <laughs> what? Wow. Yes. What? That is impressive. Wait. Really? Oh, I have advantage. It's alert juice. Okay. Uh... 17? 17. Okay. Sorry, 18. 18. Well, Woke juice. I did not do a very good job. Because I did a nat 20, and then this is a nat 1. <laughs> you just see him, like, flaunting a gold coin, thinking you are far too invested to notice. Riss. Yes. Would you like some of this? And as he begins to open his mouth, I'm going to sh- chuck it in. What? <laughs> So that would be a deck save on my part. Um, just a little bit. Just so, you, so t- <laughs> to clarify, it's not like a you're not, bottle. <laughs> you have a teacup in your hand. Yeah, he goes. Uh, <laughs> Are you throwing the teacup? No, I'm not throwing the teacup. Oh, okay. <laughs> oh, then that would be hilarious. Hang on. So hang on. Hang on. Hang on. Hang on. You got to make a deck save. To hang, see on, hang on. Hang on. Hang on. Hang on. Okay. This is Kudo. He's a dick. This is also Sulan's teacup. 
That's a good point. He's mm. not that. He's not that much of an idiot. Well, he, he did. You he sat. Did, although, he sat in the he chair. He did sit in Serbina. Serbina's chair. So mm-hmm. I, I think, think his he respect roll. for authority only exists. In but paradise. then again, he did learn from that, so I don't think he'd be this dumb. Yeah. Although. <laughs> This, this pros is his, and cons this list is goes on forever. Process. Okay. Destruction and defiance are two what. different things. Tell you what, we're gonna roll to see if he's as dumb. Above ten, he's smart. Below ten, he's not. Eighteen, he's not gonna throw it. I thought it was the ten. Right. I was like middle of the road. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's a bad average. Okay. <clears throat> so are you splashing the tea in his face? Yes, that's what I'm gonna do. Okay. Simply because you rolled in that one. Mm. <laughs> Instead of it being a deck save, which you would almost certainly pass, yes, very much. make an attack roll. You are only adding your dexterity. No proficiency. Oh, okay. <laughs> That's, That's a non-natural 20. <laughs> wait, wait, non-natural 20? No. no. Misses his armor class. What? Yes. We're well, talking armor class do here? Do you have your no. shield? No, I don't have my shield. Up. Then. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> What's your armor class with that shield? 19. Ah! Or 18. Really? Yeah, 17. 17. That's right. Oh, oh I would have hit you without the plus three. Yep. Uh, so as you just go, is that a con save? <laughs> you get a yes. Please make a Constitution <laughs> saving throw. Uh, yes, yeah, seven. So slightly better. Is it though? Then his. He got a six. Right? Well, no, I'm not saying that. <laughs> no. <laughs> you um. Juice. I I do need you to make a secondary a second Constitution saving a throw. Secondary attack. 20 not good 20. <laughs> it doesn't get in your eyes Ooh, <laughs> you splash it in his face i did yeah oh that's true yeah the uh the liquid as you notice as you splash it out does have these like almost fine glimmering nope particles in it uh it you do get Same a effect. taste uh and you 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 are instinctually know to close your eyes, so in your face kind of like, kind of like uh, right after shaving, just like stings <laughs> just a little bit. After shave, yep, gotcha. yeah, a little bit, and uh, but you absolutely do taste a little bit, and it's <laughs> you go wide eyed. <laughs> okay, can you explain this effect? Like, what is this? What do we have right now? Because this sounds like a really, really fun little. Ability boost here. It is, uh, you do have a plus five to perception checks. Okay. You have disadvantage on stealth, sleight of hand, You're and so jittery. deception checks. Because you are wired. <laughs> Kudo looks at the bartender. Can I get this in a flask to go? Uh, the bartender kind of just looks at Sulan just, I do believe it's best had in moderation. I like to think in the background... If you pass the con save, you uh, you don't get the uh, negative side effects. Riss is oh, over okay. here like... Didn't like that taste save. much. <laughs> I believe it. I mean, at that point, I'd probably just fail out of that. Yeah. <laughs> I like to think... But I like this thing. I want to keep some of this. I like to think that in the background right now, like, Einar has gotten like a plate or a tray of food and he has like a cup on there. Oh yeah. And he's just by the like, time this conversation up. is done, there is a heavy smell of cooking meat yes. coming from the kitchen. But I like to think that as as this happens like Einar gets to catch a glimpse of this interaction, looks at Sulan, looks back at them, and then goes find it at a table on like the other side of the bar. <laughs> Riss, upon having now a passive perception of 25, looks at Einar and goes, why are you sitting over there? <laughs> it doesn't It doesn't add to your passive. Oh, It okay. adds it to your checks. Well, uh, his Keen passive's would, still 20. So. It is a 20. Keen yeah. would also be sitting yep. nearby you. Einar just yells Kindly over to Riss, preserved. it's safe over here. Riss, with no the one of this dude is so friggin' perceptive this every time someone walks into his are. bar. Well, bar. Well, maybe. Mm, his passive perception maybe. In the mornings, without you this seem fun. is a 29. Mm, okay, we'll go with that. <laughs> Kudo's going to look at someone and go, you mind if, I, mind if I put this in my uh, in my flask? I like it. You can keep the cup that has been poured for you. Okay, thank you. Which is all over my Which face. Which has about like a sip left after you splashed it. In. Riss is looking at Sulan. How long do the effects last? 
should... <laughs> For you, it shouldn't last more than a few minutes. Good, because I cannot blink. What about me? <laughs> Probably about an hour. Oh, this is good. I like this stuff. It sucks to drink, but I like it. Yeah, it very much sucks to drink. That is the most unholy, and unnatural more? thing. No. Actually, it is quite natural. What's and made of? Actually, you can make a uh, nature check if you'd like. Can I help him? Let's do that. Uh, 15. No, actually, only... Um, okay. Oh, hmm? 15. 15? Uh, there's, a, there's something about it that's vaguely familiar. You get, you get the sense that it is of elven origin. Ah. Yeah. Either way. I meant unnatural in the sense this tingling sensation is not what I prefer oh, to experience. I like it. I will reserve Somehow judgment. Somehow that doesn't surprise me. I trust that your endeavor was successful. Yes. Yeah. Don't know what happened after I got swallowed by a frost worm. Oh, yeah, they got eaten by a worm. It was kind of hilarious. Oh, um, speaking I... of, and Kin comes up to Kudo. Yes. And holds out her hand. And he gives her a high five. Riss. Okay, hold on. The book. Oh, I'm going to hold on to it for a little while. He's a little jittery. He's like, I'm having a good time. <laughs> That's a no, you will not. Non natural. What do you mean? On insight. He's gonna What's go, up? Kudo's going to go. Kudo. Riss is going to turn to Kudo and go, My jittery friend. Yeah. The book. Yeah. Her. I have it. I know. Yes. Give it to her. Oh, okay. I can do that. And he gives it to her. Thank you. And you kind of just reach out, and as you are reaching out to hand it to her, the book manifests in your hand. Just one moment you blink, and it's there. I and still think this is the coolest thing I've ever seen right here. And Keen, you. you take it. I love the start that we're off to today, but I'm going to keep this important thing in the hands of people who can be responsible today. I am very responsible. No, you're not. <laughs> Shut up, loner. <laughs> I'm not alone. Not anymore. Not ever again. <laughs> don't don't hear Ray. I have this a bunch of souls trapped inside with me. Ray Riss looks Riss. over. Like, don't let Ray hear you say that. It will cause him unease. Yeah, don't tell Ray about the multiple I already horses caused in Ray does, unease. Does he not know about this? No. The, uh, uh Absorption. A little bit. Uh, Just a little bit. I mean, he knows about like three or two. These minutes are going to go by very slowly for me because I cannot stop talking right now. I'm and sorry. I still can't blink. <laughs> yes, thank you. How many now have you collected? Einar holds up a hand with all the fingers out. I think. Pretty sure it's only been five. You can't check? It's your soul bank. One second. Einar's going to summon Harold. He's going to try and summon Harold, like a mini version of Harold in the palm of his hand, because Einar's sitting down. What do you say? <laughs> Harold, come forth. Nothing appears in your hand, but coming, slipping from behind you like your mm. very own shadow, kind of just, and then appearing basically in the booth next to you. <laughs> Einar looks over and goes, oh. Oh my gosh, right. this is the best, actually, this seat's taken move ever. <laughs> Um, you can't sit with us. <laughs> <coughs> yes. No, I was hoping you would form in my hand to, so it was a little more convenient. But I suppose I could just turn and look at you. Harold, how many souls do I have right now? If I am counting correctly, the Cyclops from the island. Yep. The... Canyon Wyvern. Yep. The Dream Spirit. That's right. That's right. Yep. And then the two I got yesterday. Last night. Whatever. Right? Are they there? I believe so. Hmm. Believe so. Yes, believe so does sound strange. I would but... like to very quickly make a perception check of the people in the room as he, you know, Go for it. summons a shadow to talk to. Uh, three, five, ten. Ten? Yeah. What do you roll? Uh, three. Plus two, plus five. Fair. Didn't, okay, fair. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Uh, you're you're kind of wired and you look around. Um, hey, remind me, what's the name of this tavern? 
Yeah, okay, never mind. Some of the show. No one cares. <laughs> Weirder I, things have happened on a regular basis. Risk goes, Jedi business, go back to your drinks. <laughs> There's also only a handful of people around at the moment. Okay. Yeah. This, uh, is, this is, is morning. morning. Yeah. Uh, Sulan's two bodyguards, the uh, Minotaur and the uh, Warforged, are, as always, present, keeping an eye on him. Um, you don't see Kadir. Um but other than that, there's just a handful, like maybe six or seven, just citizens, patrons, regulars, okay, just hanging out, and none of them bat an eye at uh, at the Herald. Okay, Einar feels very at home at this place, to be honest. <laughs> Can I make He's a just chilling. General, I don't know what kind of check on the Herald. So uh, I assume I have not seen him before. That's no. a good point, actually. Um, what are you trying to discern? What is that? <laughs> oh, oh, sorry, sorry. Um, okay, Keen, okay, okay. Keen, this is Harold. Harold, this is Keen. Say hello, Harold. Hello. Oh, Harold, hello. you can do better than that. Give her a little bit of a good day, miss. You don't know you, Harold like I know Harold. I know, but it's fun to mess with him. You, I apologize, Harold. You, yes, you may go. <laughs> And he vanishes. Big on thought. <laughs> I assume this is similar, not the same, to the souls you have collected. No, no, no. no. This he is, helps this you. Is, yeah, Her- Harold and I have a very, uh, we'll call it interesting relationship. They're friends. Are you partners, or is he a parasite? Yes. Parasite? You oh. don't know Harold like I know Harold. Shush. Am I wrong, though? And then you see Riss. Finally, <laughs> <laughs> he blinks. As your focus, com- as your vision comes back into focus. <laughs> I would like to really quickly roll an insight check on Keen. All right, go for it. Just because. Where's my? Ooh, that's pretty good. Hmm. Uh, twenty-five. Twenty-five. What are you insight checking? I'm a little concerned with the one, the way that she asked for the book, and two, being a little. Like, what's her reaction to uh, Harold? Well, with the 25... A lot of strange things have been appearing since she met these people, and she's not sure she trusts them. She is working with them. They're entertaining in a few ways. She does not trust you all. Mm. And so... I think the book please, so, honestly. The, please explain to me what is going on, and so I do not attack you in self-defense, thinking that you are trying to kill me. Gotcha. Uh, that kind of thing. Uh, go ahead and make a religion check for me. Sure. Ooh. I need my rolling point. Need to consult so the religious text. Um, the sacred, sacred, sacred text. text. <laughs> uh, the one good thing to come out of that movie. <laughs> an eighteen. In an eighteen. Okay. Um, there's actually a striking of familiarity. Hmm. Um, the way that Harold is called forth and all that. Um, you're not a cleric, but you are a divine soul sorcerer. And so your magic, the, your abilities come from a deity. Um, and there's a familiarity. It's not like it's the same source, but it's the same way you might summon... Uh, the energy for a spell or one of your class abilities there's a very similar way that the um, that the herald manifests see uh, that reminds you of uh, of what you yourself are able to do all right so no herald is not a parasite he is in a way we are each other's guardians. Against what? Mm, just about everything, honestly. He has gotten me out of a pickle many times, and I, well, I suppose I can't quite consider myself his guardian. Um, but... You have nothing to fear from them as long as you are working with them, in other words. Although, be careful when you spar him. Okay, that's... Fair. I'm also intrigued about what that means, but, uh... <clears throat> well, you want to find out? You want to fight me? Not right now. Why I know not? we're in a shady part of town, but... 
I assumed you all did not want to be here that long. No, not really. No, no. We postpone. We will be moving on to the next segment of our journey. Which, speaking of, yeah, where is that? Where are we going? Yes, Keen. You know the location of the stronghold, correct? Do I? <laughs> so somebody did. I don't remember who it was. Of the rest of the vault. Yes. Uh, Ray. Ray did. Ah, that's Ray's right. the one who translated the inscription. Hmm. <laughs> okay, when is he coming back? Ray? Yes. Well, we don't have a daughter with us, so who knows? <laughs> <laughs> you know what? That's that's fair play considering what you were on earlier this session. Go back to hell. <laughs> <laughs> Not go to hell. Go back to hell. <laughs> Go back from whence, from whence you, came. you came. No, in all seriousness, though. And well, in addition... I don't think we were given a table, timetable for that. Well, that's all right. We can uh, quick find out. Einar's going to send a message... Or send you sending to uh, communicate to Ray. You, all you right. did exactly what I told you to do. Good job. Which and, is great, because I did uh, not remember I was supposed to do that. Oh, my God. <laughs> I wasn't going to say anything. <laughs> why does that not surprise me? Why is Einar a self-insert? <laughs> uh, in addition from the information you received uh, from the alternate version of Zara uh, the plan is to uh, deal with a certain someone prior yes. to approaching the vault well I'll wait until you uh, finish yes. communicating so what do you send to Ray? We have all the books ready for your return. Please bring back sanity. I know. Tell him I said hi. Uh, and Briss says hi. <laughs> How does Ray respond? I think he's going to talk to Makoto first, just to finalize the plan and figure out if we want to meet them at the vault or if we want to meet them somewhere else. Can you delay a message with sending? No. Nope. Oh, you, you say next. I have to. Oh, I have to. Okay. Um, Call back in 10 minutes. <laughs> huh. Busy. No, that's actually exactly what I was going to say. It's like, understood. Now that we have the book, we can formulate a meeting place. It's one word. No it's, no, it's not. No, it's not. Damn it. That's three. <laughs> <laughs> Message me after I speak to Makoto. Also, fuck off, Russ. <laughs> and with Ray. that, we are actually going to cut to Ray and Makoto for the first time in a few sessions. No. Wow. I never thought I'd be this excited to get my wizard back. <laughs> <laughs> I never thought I'd be excited to have Ray back. I know. Hey! <laughs> <laughs> to be fair, to be fair, I thoroughly enjoy the Riss and Ray dynamic. So I very much missed it. Fair. So um, I need to check. Oh my god, I have an idea when he sends. You're a dick. You know that. I know exactly what you're thinking. Yep. Um, one, you're giving Ray inspiration for that. <laughs> It's amazing. <laughs> Two, uh, real quick, we're going to do of Ray and Makoto's level ups. Yes. Boo. Would you shut? <laughs> I'm gonna banish you when I get back, and I'm Rude. just gonna leave you there for a little bit and see how you like it. Rude. You realize so. I can, with a high enough roll, steal everything that makes you strong. And you then cannot, leave you. This is not Skyrim. You cannot steal the armor off his back. Watch me. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, and watch me smack you in the head. Dunk. Get off me. I'm pretty sleep. sure one of the features is that they cannot be removed from him while he is Correct. alive. While he is alive. Yes. My so, armor. I'm freaking Iron Man, guys. He's only half a soul, so. <laughs> Dunk. So you are yeah, and you're the you're the Fae Queen's bitch, so Whoa there. Uncalled for. Yeah, it is in no like, way uncalled for. <laughs> whoa. It's I, like whoa. whoa. 
<laughs> so you're going to take a level in Artificer. Yes, I am. And get your... Uh, get, Subclass. Well, specialist. Yeah, yep. specialist. All right, and you're going right. with the Armorer. Going with the Armorer. And yep. it's not showing. Oh, wait, that's Armor Model. Okay. Wait a second. Did you already... I already did it. Yeah. Okay, cool. Yes, I get this. Go ahead and roll your D8. Yeah. Roll well. Six. Oh, All right. There you go. Man, I should have been rolling right, that dice. Did I right want <laughs> And I'm going to level Makoto up. Get her done. Makoto. What no, is she? She's always been higher level than us. She's probably like level 16 now or something. I think it's 15. Yeah. Well, I think she That's probably one. was 15. Oh, is she four That's above? One. That's exactly what I wanted. That's a four. Nice. Lord have mercy. She's a D6. What is she? She's a wizard. Oh, just, oh yeah. I, for some reason, thought she was a warlock or something. Sweet. Trey Makoto is officially in triple digits. Woohoo! Very good, good. for her. Wait a minute. No oh, health wise. Yes. Yep. Squinchy. Wait, I don't Ray, like are you that. in triple digits? No. <laughs> what a loser! <laughs> rude. rude, rude as heck. I really do need to get back there and give them some semblance of sanity. <laughs> you really do. <laughs> This is. They, listen, if we oh, want an expert on stabbing me, ourselves, we'll give you a call, forever. okay? And normally that would be addressed to Noah. I was about to say, <laughs> when did I stab myself? Ray? <laughs> you you, you kind of did. I don't remember doing Ooh. that. When I After that. the statue. Oh, yeah, that. That's right. Yeah. Anyway. Oh, that's technically meta knowledge, so I don't think Riss knew about that. No, he does not know about that. Yes. No, he does. Sarah told him. Oh, yeah, that's true. That yeah. is that's like true. Sarah yeah. Vienna, freaking the, snitch. Yeah, no kidding. <laughs> you beat me to it. So we cut to Ray and Makoto. Ray sporting a brand new suit of armor. Makoto herself, uh, having trained a bit in the arcane in the downtime, but also just very much enjoying some time with her father when the world isn't constantly going to shit. I mean, it is, but right now that's not our. It's problem. not their. Pro- it's not what they're messing with at the moment. They took a side Precisely. quest. Yeah, they Very took much a side so. quest for ice cream. They did a side quest for armor. Um, okay, well, that's it was, my. It was, ice it was cream. a side quest for the side quest for ice cream. Sure, sure. Kiara, I need a drawing of Ray and. Uh, uh, Makoto having ice cream together. Yeah. How tall is Makoto? Is she 5'8"? I don't know. Okay. And let's see if I have it written on her character sheet. I don't. I'll have to check her model later. All right. But regardless. Cool. So. Yeah, I, uh, well, I got to get back into Ray's voice. <clears throat> I just received word from Einar. I could tell. Okay. There was, there isn't many other people you would just say... Fuck Riss, too. Um, you if have Seravina contacted Riss. you on their behalf, you wouldn't have said that. And Einar's kind of the only other one. That's a good point. I don't know of anyone else who would uh, take it that way. But uh, hopefully that message got across. So. I have no doubt. Yeah. Hey, Riss. Yes. Ray says, fuck you. Oh, he misses me. <laughs> Inspiration. <laughs> I was so hoping you gave me everything I wanted. <laughs> okay. So they've acquired the final book, and I know I was asking about the next move. Oh, does Ray not know that the final book isn't ours? No, we have. Don't think he does. No, it's hers. Oh, he doesn't oh, know that, we yeah. are one question. That's okay. Less. He doesn't need to know. Isn't this is in I character know, we'll versus actually later. well more importantly did the conversation about dealing with Kravaki first happen before or after Ray left Riz yeah, would have told before. Before. before I was the one who was heading that the so, deal with the book obviously happened yeah, after, yeah. But yeah. yeah so I guess that means Well, not the vault yet, because... No, not yet. We have to deal with the potential... (sighs) What do you want to call him? Roadkill? Or the thing that you hit with a vehicle when you're driving? Uh, The 
piece of lint that gets stuck in uh, in your clothes. That uh, that trash. Yes, that. Yes, I would. Yeah. We can simplify. I don't think he's worth the effort. <laughs> so we have to find his location and subsequently take care of him. And unfortunately, at this time, I don't have a way of identifying where he would be other than uh, maybe asking Seravina, but I'm not entirely sure I want to. Can Rish use his criminal contacts, please? Wait, what What do you say? I want to use my criminal contacts. <laughs> that, yeah, uh, that's actually. possibly an option. Uh-huh. So, um, other than potentially contacting uh, well, the contacts that we have, uh, around various parts of the world. We could do that. Do you have scrying? I was literally just checking. Uh, unfortunately, I do not. Let me see if I do, actually. Might be I thought you did. Like. I thought you scried multiple times. I have. I do have scrying. No. Never mind. Uh, I do have scrying. Yeah, Ray did. Yeah. yeah. Not so I'm going to say that uh, that... Didn't happen. <laughs> uh, that conversation. No, no, it absolutely happened because Ray losing track of what's in his own spell book. Yeah, yeah that's in character. Okay, that's okay. That's fair. And then Ray goes, "Wait, I do have a way of contact." Y- of, uh, yeah, yeah, you, you kind of beat me to it, but yeah. Well then, I'm still quick on my feet, even with half a soul. <laughs> Don't say anything, Makoto. Uh, yeah, I think that's best. <laughs> Be happy for your old man. I am. But you're also insane. <laughs> I'm not insane. At least not like Riss and I know. Uh, Riss is not insane. He's just chaotic. You I don't know what's mo- happening. I know is most certainly would be considered insane by most people. Yes. I think if you look up the Merriam-Webster definition of insane, you'll... Well, Merriam-Webster doesn't exist in this world. No, it's the Merriam... Got him. <laughs> yeah. So, where, where are my where are my symbols? <laughs> <laughs> all right, all right. Hang on. You take your one. <laughs> no, you you all have to agree. <laughs> all in favor? Uh, all in favor? Hi. Uh, no. <laughs> Dang it. Okay. Okay. Um. In that case, just for the record, that was uh two out of five. So no majority. Dang it. Two out of five. Oh yeah. One, two, three, four, what? five. Okay, fine. I don't know about that. You voted in your favor last time. That's a good point. Who wrote this constitution? There is no constitution. This is, this is what happens when a bunch of idiots get together and play D&D. Yep. <laughs> you ain't wrong. <laughs> I, I love it. Say. Okay. This is a highlight of my week. Back to... Okay. I know going to contact me here in a little bit, and I'll let him know that I will... You scrying to locate, or at least get an eye on Korvaki, and then we could potentially... All right, and then I can... Uh... Get us back there. Mm-hmm. I Easy think that's enough. a good plan. All right, now we just wait for Einar to send us a message again. Einar's busy eating bacon. Five. I love that you put it into his hands. Ten oh. minutes go by. Uh, Riss will just be chatting about the weather with his oh, yeah. girl. We're going to find yes. out how many minutes Einar spends eating bacon. Oh, I'm going to add the no. D for it just in oh, case. No. Yep, as you should. Yes. Okay. It's high. Fifteen. Okay, 15 that's not that's not that bad. It's not terrible, but he spends fifteen minutes doing nothing but roll eating a, bacon. Roll a d six. See how many pieces of bacon per minute. How many pieces of bacon <laughs> per minute? Yeah, this is gonna be like high too. Oh, oh. dead gummit. He's off his game. Give yourself pieces guidance for that too. <laughs> guidance is a wolf down. Okay, four. four. All right, four. Yeah, that's more average. So that's sixty pieces. Sixty of pieces of bacon. <laughs> <laughs> Make a constitution saving throw. <laughs> you enforced this upon yourself. I did. You know what? You know what? I did. And if I end up being like a little bloated, I deserve it. But it'll be worth it. Hey, uh, who's paying for all that bacon that you're guzzling? That's a nineteen. One of us. Ooh, that's not bad. Definitely could have been worse. Yeah. So after he goes to the bathroom. <laughs> yes. So another. <laughs> Ten minutes goes by <laughs> as he's wolfing down bacon. You uh, you kind of just walk out and just like, don't go in there. <laughs> <laughs> Hold on, 
<clears throat> I must have that interaction with with Riss. I'm assuming Riss is coming in to use the bathroom. Oh uh, no, I was going to say Riss is going to talk to Sulan. But ah. yes, we can also do this while he is while he is in the bathroom. <laughs> you go, go and guys. talk to Sulan. <laughs> Sulan, who besides your wise and self would I speak to if I wanted to locate? <laughs> I'm afraid you'll have to be a bit more specific. Does the name Korvaki ring a bell? Please reply. It's a 19 on the die. Wow. He knows. He knows. Quick, give him guidance. <laughs> Don't put your hands on him. <laughs> no. <laughs> you know, it's vague, but... I do have a faint recollection of one bearing that name. I do not want to violate any code of thieves here. <laughs> Don't worry. Ah, okay, good. It's nice to know he doesn't fall under that code. Oh, it's that very few do. To what few rules exist. Understood. I like these rules and I accept them. Now, who would I go to to learn this lo location of this man? Or if you only have a location, that helps as well. I'm not certain off the top of my head. When it comes to finding people, do you know what region of the world he was last seen in, whether he has any items of great power, whether he has anything that could be used. Can, do I have to roll intelligence to remember what he had, what he took from Serevina? Uh, if you remember it. I don't remember it. Yeah, oh, okay. so go ahead and make a, um, yeah, go ahead and make a, a flat intelligence check. I don't remember it. Then ask. Then you're, you're right there, Wolf. No, I know. I'm. I'm in. I'm in. He's in the bathroom at the jump. moment. Mother. I'm. I'm, I'm taking a dump. <laughs> um, all right. So I took four to remember the item, but he's going to roll. Yeah, he does not remember much about Korvaki. Um, he'll hold up a hand and go. I know he was fleeing from Meyer, but Einar will know more information once he has emerged. Five more minutes go by. And our exits goes. I'm curious. What do you know? What have you heard his name regarding? There's very few rogues that get to a certain level of skill without showing up on someone's radar. This is true. Ah, I know. All right. Oh, that was needed. Sit down. We're talking about our favorite person we want to kill. Ah, I see. By the way, don't go in there. Uh, so why are we talking about Kurvaki? Kudo go, starts to go to the bathroom. Einar grabs him by the collar, brings him back towards him and goes, What did I just say? I didn't hear what you said. I said... He said go in there. You know what? No. Go, go for it. <laughs> Einar just lets him go. Anyway, Kurvaki, what about him? When it comes to what the fuck, <laughs> Riss goes one moment, and I would like, to, I would like to make, and well, I guess this would just be initiative. Make a, make a perception check. No, what he wants make to do. Make a perception. Oh, a perception check. check. Uh, twenty nine. You don't want to have rolled high on this one. <laughs> Guess what? Guess what? Used? Guess what? Skill is used for the sense of smell. Yeah. <laughs> Riss upon smelling. Okay, so Kudo with his twenty. Open. With the twenty. Oh, okay, so you're. There's a little coming tailwind out. coming he's with leaving. Einar. Oh, he's leaving. Okay. He's leaving. He's like duff. Riss goes the door, and turns back to the conversation. Uh, Sulan literally just uh, turns his hand, and the door shuts on its own. Wow, that's so cool. Oh, God, thank Wait. you. I didn't want to go back near that thing. I don't know. What the hell did you eat? Bacon. He ate half a bacon. Lots pig. of bacon. With more than enough grease, I'm sure. Mm-hmm. It was very good. Anyway. I'm glad. 
Now, back to business, if you don't mind. Oh, sorry, I just finished mine. <laughs> Indeed. I know, we are being serious. I, I apologize. I needed to... I needed to have a little bit of shenanigans in the morning after you and Kudo. Stop breaking the fourth wall. Is that what Keen says? <laughs> <laughs> anyway, you three walls. <laughs> when it comes to locating your friend, I know it's not exactly an accurate term, but nonetheless, do you have any? Ideas as to where, what region of the world he might be in, what he might be carrying, anything that could be Oh, used. like the crystals? Like the arcane Thank crystals you. that, you know, I could not remember them to save my life. It's magic. Devour your soul, those crystals? Yes. yes. I Isn't, don't think, I don't think they devour your soul. If you use them, they take a piece of your soul is what No, no, if I remember correctly, it can take over your entire soul. Well, regardless, yes. part Sulan. of the danger. Well, if you die, that was the them. item I was trying to think of. Do you remember specifically if Seraphine had heard where he was? I guess I have to make. It Did you say the name Seraphine out loud? Yeah. Okay, cool. Never mind. You're not. You're not right. I know. I don't care. <laughs> Catch it. Oh. What were ah. you rolling for, buddy? Uh, history to remember. If Seravina said where, that hit the floor, my friend. That's a net one. No, no. Hey, look. That's a. That's a. Uh, do I have anything in history? I don't think so. Nope. That's a ten. <laughs> All right. Well, if he is carrying something of a significant arcane power, there are those who have ways of locating such things. I can get in touch with some contacts. Uh, there would be a required fee. How much? Well... <sighs> the technology is experimental the cost would give you a an exact location but it's not cheap how expensive are we talking roughly 10,000 gold <coughs> Well, it's uh, doable, but... Um, you hear a little voice in the back of your head. Just take out another loan. <laughs> no, we don't, because that voice is with Ray, and he's not here. So that, That's a nightmare returning from Einar <laughs> right there. That's, that's what happened. Worse than getting shanked by the Shadow King? Yeah, that was all right. Okay. I feel like Shank is underplaying it. The shit yeah. sounds. It's well, it's like awful. when Doctor Strange like, oh, got shit. stabbed like <laughs> seventeen times. It actually times. is, yeah. Yeah, it's like that. Um, yeah. Perhaps we'll save that as a last resort, assuming that Ray doesn't have any information on it. I think it would Where probably be better to talk to. Oh, sh I should talk to him. One moment. <clears throat> He's one that appreciates privacy and has paid very handsomely to ensure that it stays that way. But rest assured, I believe I've proven that I can be trusted. Indeed. Or at least that I will be up front with the circumstances. And so, if you're able to, I can happily act as the go-between. Understood. Go message the third person in my yes. party. Meanwhile, <laughs> five gold, it's bacon. I'm not taking that bet. Because you're right. Yeah. How much bacon? Ooh. That's the real question. I hope they're not in a public inn. 
They probably are. Oh, that's right. They don't know we're wanted. <laughs> oh, shit. That's right. <laughs> Actually, that's I'm going to roll an investigation this check is like, for Makoto. This is like a lay low at Stitch when John Von Pleakley get fired and he's like, Right, now we do it my way. Yeah, yeah, yeah we, we're wanted men. <laughs> <laughs> I hate that that's really accurate. Yep. yep. <laughs> Well, you know, considering the bounty on their heads at the moment, uh, she rolled a 25 on investigation. Dad, go! You would have known about it. Okay. She would have told you. Okay. Is that true? Yeah. Awesome. Mm, thanks. Um, yeah, you're right. They're probably with uh, Sulan. Yeah. I hope he knows you know what? the digitation. Five gold to the bathroom. <laughs> Again, I'm not taking that bet. <laughs> <sighs> I preferred when you were dumber. <laughs> <laughs> dang, throwing shade. It's a compliment in, in reality. <laughs> but dang, it's throwing shade. Uh, I'm only the, the, the Risk uh-huh. without hesitation would have said, I'm I only prefer when you were thing. Kenku. <laughs> and you would have immediately gotten had gravity well. shifted. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. Yep. Um, but at this point, Ray, sorry, I forgot. I was busy. Um, <clears throat> we're ready. And I may have a way to find Korvaki, but it's really expensive. No more loans. <laughs> Eloquence is always my friend. <laughs> Explain this method. I can use scrying for more intel. And then we can formulate a plan to find him. Also, fuck you, Riss. Right. Why don't we just go there? Yeah, we can do that too. And it's at that moment that Ray hears a reply. Ray, this is my last spell slot for this spell. Please, let's talk in person. Come here. Ray responds, okay, we'll see you in a few days. Did you tell Riss about the... uh... Riss, (laughs) make a deception check. (laughs) Riss, guess what he said. What? Natural 20! Are you going to guess? Are you gonna guess? It's Ray. He says a lot of things. What? What do you? Th- okay. Is this something about Makoto? Oh, man, he really misses me. <laughs> I know it's great. He does. So you you did receive the message, and you one hundred percent believe it of because it was a natural twenty of uh, see you in a few days. Okay. Einar, do you, Einar have, do you have a response back? I, I cannot. No, Einar starts looking at his hand and goes, "You know, it's only half a soul." <laughs> but it is still half a soul. I'm going to beat his ass when he gets over Please here. Please tell me I'm behind him as he's doing that. <laughs> uh, Makoto offers her hand. Ray takes it. And she casts teleport. Mm-hmm. Which she has. Um, nice. And that's what I rolled for earlier. Ah! Oh no. I uh, this would have happened regardless. Okay. But she rolled a 91. Whoa, okay. Uh, it's a, it's just you roll a d100. Okay. And uh, as a result, even oh, if she only had a description of the place, it would be on target. Okay, cool. So, as Einar says, I'm going to beat his ass when he gets here. You are standing behind. Okay, okay, hold on. We got to roll initiative real quick. Because <laughs> Riss will immediately try to make eye contact with Keen. And signal, like, and then turn. You, we don't need to roll initiative. And then it's... turn to Ray and go, Ray, wait, 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 hold on. We found your other daughter. And points to uh, Akeen. And I'm going to okay, roll okay, for okay. deception. Okay. Roll for to... initiative. Because yes, I, okay. I rolled a 21. Have, I, I need I need Riss, Ray, and Einar to. 24. 
No, you I, lie. No, I do got not. 19 on the die. You lie. And Einar? That's oh, I got four. an 8. Okay. So, literally, you show up and you're about to just like... And Rish just turns to you and says... Ray, you will not believe this. We found your other daughter. You need to roll deception. <laughs> Make a deception check. <laughs> 25. <pretty> good. <laughs> what, am I, what am I rolling against that? Insight? Insight? <laughs> <laughs> Come on, roll a natural 20. No. <laughs> no. Oh, and what's Makoto's reaction? Because this is hilarious, and you didn't tell Makoto beforehand, so I'm going to leave right, this up to you how right. she re- responds. Dad? Ray's... L- fuck you. <laughs> <laughs> you get deception check? Yeah, yeah. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Wait, hang hey. on, okay. Wait, wait, wait. Actually, make it with advantage because, the, because of the fact that Riss is sure. succeeded. So she's making the deception check with advantage. Okay. Uh, 16. Uh, 16 total with the, advantage? The advantage was a natural one. Ooh. Uh, yeah. Inspiration. <laughs> okay. And that's my inspiration yep, for you. Yep, yep. No, another natural one. Uh, what? Wow. You kind of... <laughs> you... That <laughs> dice tray is Rolling. not... Your friend. Sometimes it is my friend. There, it, this dice had a train where it would go from owo to uwu. Um, like the the uwu. The I, uwu I like, always comes before the uwu. I like how. Yeah. That's how it was described, which is a hundred percent correct. Always comes before the uwu. Uh, that's true. But I completely those understood are the facts. that. Can't do that to me. Slew him on the spot. That's great. <laughs> Anyways. 16 deception is still pretty good. You can't do that. You broke the DM. Yeah. From O to O. Anyways. Trey, Trey, Trey. Focus. Okay, okay. Really Can I also... Breathe. Make eye contact with Makoto as an, a part of my action. No, you can't do that. You're not the DM. Well, his action was speaking. Yes. So I guess... Eye movement. Make a be... persuasion check with disadvantage because okay. we're not in combat order. This is these aren't actions. This is a look. Damn it! I... Did you double nat one? No, I had a natural nat twenty nat and a thirteen oh. for perception or persuasion. <laughs> if anyone wanted so to give, so fifteen. A... What? If anyone wanted to give? Well, I would still oh, roll. I mean. It was dis- disadvantage. Pers- uh, persuasion to. Um, I mean, it's still a fifteen. Persuasion to Makoto. Makoto to play along. Yes. I have an inspiration. <laughs> That's a dirty 20. Okay. I rolled I'm an going to have her day. roll an insight check. <laughs> so many things happening at once. That was a natural 20. <laughs> I'm so mad. Sis? <laughs> she runs into her arms. Oh my gosh, it's been so long. You found him. You actually found him. She... I, I'm gonna head out. Makoto needs to... I know he just slowly raises another piece of bacon into his mouth and starts chewing on it as he watches this unfold. And once it comes back, it's to Rissa's turn. Ray is just standing there, stunned at the moment. He has I don't have a reaction because he's trying to process what the hell just happened. Ray is blue screening. Yes, that's exactly <laughs> what's happening. Please restart. Riss is going to, <laughs> Riss is going uh, to stand up and go, Makoto I think it's smiles. time for me to go. <laughs> smiles and, you know, kind of just backs up and kind of just looks at Ray. What? 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 Uh, what? What? Who are you? Are you okay? I don't. I don't. It's, what? It's been a long time. I know. Congratulations, I guess. <laughs> what is? <laughs> what? What did you want me to say? <laughs> he's like looking. At, he's daughter. looking at everyone, and then he looks at Kudo. I don't know who you are. What is happening? Riss. Who are you? Well, I was informed that. Uh, you, you had a a little ordeal with your memory. Um, hang on, hang I on. I need to I need to make an insight yep. check for that one. Yep. Okay, that's a fifteen. 
That's a that's a twelve. Okay, he kind of he kind of is like. By the way, on Riss's turn, stealth to hide. <laughs> <laughs> you can make a stealth check. Thirty three. I already rolled, and we can confirm. Lucky. At, so her explanation throws Ray off a little bit because she says going. specifically, well, I heard that you've had an issue with your memory. And he's very taken aback by that. Still is like half in shock, but half like, okay, someone's got to be messing with me. I, I don't have... Dashi said nothing. Kosen said nothing. Makoto said nothing. There's no... And neither did Hana. <laughs> <laughs> You don't even look like her. <laughs> who are who are you? Um I, I like to think all of that was said out loud. Yes. <laughs> that was in character. Good. You what is your name? Probably don't remember it happening either. It's a lot of things I don't remember, so if I have a second daughter And then he blue screens again. Hold on. I, I... Trey, can I make a constitution saving throw to find out if Einar starts Makoto out is going laughing? to make a constitution is going to make me the same. <laughs> please fail, please fail. Oh, no. What'd you roll? I rolled a 17. That's fail. That's fail? You tell me a 17 passes. That's a good point. Yeah, I suppose. <laughs> yeah, Makoto only rolled a 13. So both Makoto and I are at this point. And a 9. So, and Keen <laughs> all everyone. burst out laughing. <laughs> Ray, we missed you. I'm so sorry. <laughs> Riss just locked eyes and I knew exactly what he had done. The, okay, so you remember when Makoto was mad when she got off the boat? Multiply that by about five. Yeah. <laughs> but you have to look for him. <laughs> yeah. Where is he? Sulan points. <laughs> yes! Because <laughs> Sulan, his passive is not enough to beat that. I rolled perception. Um, he has a plus 14. Um, he rolled a 19. But he drank the tea. Oh. Uh, yes. Which brings it to a total of like 38. 38. Which so, means. Riss, Riss stands up and goes, Sulan. And then, <laughs> I promise not to lie to you. <laughs> and while that was immensely entertaining, what else is about to happen will also be very. That's true. Right? <laughs> be my guess. Oh, I think whatever's happening is happening in the space of a second. Yeah. Well, as soon as Riss sticks his head and goes, Sulan! Yeah. <laughs> Ray's gonna go, <laughs> He's just gonna be, Sulan! And just ducking down as a fireball. How block. far away is he from me? Uh, uh, like within 30 feet. feet. Cool. Uh, where is it? Here, I'm gonna tell you right now, this. <laughs> this is the animatic episode. Misty yeah. Step, right next to him. <laughs> yep. Okay. And I'm going to activate the suit of armor yep so it fully covers me including the head and the helmet comes up and you're staring at essentially a an animated suit of armor are you gonna show off one of its new abilities i'm gonna hit him with the chest beam oh literally iron man yeah wait it doesn't do a lot of damage oh so you've got the infiltrator version on yes i do I, i'm only using infiltrator guardian got it cool yeah doesn't do anything for me. Yeah, so he just boom, pops, like, vanishes, appears in front of you, and poof, make an attack roll at disadvantage because you're within five feet. Yeah, it's fine. Ooh, okay. Oh, uh, not so good. Where is that on here? Oh, there it is. Uh, yeah, it doesn't hit. It's like a 15. You have a plus nine. Yeah, I rolled yeah. a six on the die. So. Well, what was the first roll? Uh, 14 on the die, so plus 9 would be a 23. <laughs> would Riss's shocked state impose anything? No, he is one for one. He knows something was going to hit him. Okay, it's yeah. A matter of so Ray it's literally, Sulan, <laughs> pop up, Sulan. Ray appears, you immediately hit the deck, and there's just a... 21, <laughs> I use my inspiration. Oh, here's the... And then, <laughs> do, you, do you hear that? Yeah. Oh no. Would you <laughs> have a he doesn't have a shield on. He doesn't. Well, that would have that met. Would have met. Yeah. <laughs> it meets it beats. 
So. I love that we've wasted all of our inspirations <laughs> on damage. this. Six, six it's very damage. important. Here you go. I missed you too, buddy. <laughs> yeah, so you try to hit the deck, but it just kind of blasts you, and you end up slumped against the wall. Just slight singes on your shirt. <laughs> <Yep>. <laughs> and <laughs> I retract the helmet. I missed you too, and I reach out my right hand. Oh. And Riss goes, Welcome to the club. <laughs> Shakes this up. Oh. Is this like a bad luck charm? Um, you know, I didn't get, I didn't, you didn't answer my question. Who the hell are you and why are you saying you're my daughter? Well, oh, uh, I think you know the joke. You're not my daughter. I go along yeah. with the joke. Who are you? <laughs> I mean, we have no confirmation that I'm not, but. Uh, anyway, anyway, Ray, this is Keen. Keen, this is Ray. Ray, Keen is fun. Keen is... I don't believe you, but... Oh, she very much is. Keen not only saved us from being arrested, she is the um, special someone to Eroy. Oh. So. oh, you were the person they had to save. Yes. yes. Good. From okay. them. I'm glad that we were able to help Eroy out. I also turned them into worm guts. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, what? I do not remember this part of our adventure. You hear in the I back, you hear... <laughs> he remembers. Um, ah, this is the other guy I wanted to introduce you to, uh, Ray. He's been looking for you. Have fun. <laughs> <laughs> oh no. You put yourself in this place. <clears throat> if you don't mind. Son of a bitch. <laughs> <laughs> I'd like to have a word with you. I don't know who you are. That's fine. We'll, we'll get to that. I told you his name is Kudo. Yeah. Kudo Baiko. You look like you're from Paradise. I am. That's racist. I'm <laughs> from Paradise. Listen, that was just well being weird. Oh, okay. I thought it was. No, no. Yeah, those are jokes I can make. If you, uh, if you don't mind, there's a... I have a message from a, a certain someone. Insight? Pfft, never mind. <laughs> I lose that one. Yep. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> That's a 13. He follows. He follows. All right. Okay. Um, Makoto. Yeah. Wait here with them. I'll, I'll be right back. Um, <laughs> yes, I apparently have a sibling to get to know. Yes, apparently you do. Riss walks over. Hugs Makoto and says, beautiful performance as always. Thank you. Thank you. And Makoto, turns, punch him in the face for me. Rude. She gives like a light tap. <laughs> and Riss goes, oh, that hurt. Keen, great work. Thank you. I think we make a good tag team. That was. Did you get darker? What? He has spent um, a lot of time in the sun. Possibly. I definitely. I didn't think that was. Uh, okay. Well, you know, it's been a while. Uh, yeah. And uh, Einar goes to give her a hug. I've missed you. Likewise. Kudo walks Ray through the... Through the... It isn't right to say streets. Yeah. Through the halls of Mika. He doesn't say much. Kind of makes a little bit of small talk. Just you, uh, <clears throat> you got some interest in friends. Listen, I I'm, love you doing the accent. I can't. I there's times I can hit it. You got and, yourself some interest in friends. Yeah, Think you got right? yourself some interest in friends. There you go. That's a little bit better. Yeah. Think of. Think of like the uh, every single biker in every single bad movie. I just ever needed to hear it one more time. Yeah, I got you. Yeah, that's how it goes. All right, back to Ray. Back to the classic. You got boys. some. Uh, you got some interest in friends. Uh, they're very interesting. That's actually an appropriate <laughs> word. Yeah, yeah, they are. I. Riss is just a pain in the ass. Yeah, but you appreciate him for it. Oh, come on. I've seen those kind of bonds before. Oh, he said when? we have a bond. Brothers in arms. 
Are you ex paradisian military? <laughs> I mix a lot of things. <laughs> Tell me that's not something Kudo would say. It it's is. absolutely something Kudo would say. <laughs> I've been ex alive before. <laughs> yeah, that's true. But, uh, so I like him. I came here looking for you. Didn't think <laughs> it would be, uh, sticking around this long, but, uh, you took your time. Yeah, I I had things to do. Why were you looking for me? As I said, a message from a certain someone. Yes. Which probably should not be spoken where anyone can hear. Oh, okay. Um, I figured we can step outside, have a conversation without any prying eyes or ears. Is this, uh, is this Dashi then? Okay. Come on. I'll be right back. Oh, this was as you were walking. Oh, okay. okay. I assumed, yeah, you okay. all were gone. Then, um, we might want to get a little bit of a distance from here, then, yes. Exactly. Hence my thinking. So, uh, what on earth were you even doing? Your friends talk a mighty game about all these things you're trying to do, something about the vault and books and... Look, I almost got eaten by a worm for these guys. They both got eaten by a worm, but I didn't. They, they what? They look fine. Uh, it was in a, it complicated. They'll tell you about it later. Yeah, Roy. Sure. Yes. No. Listen, I am not uh, party to the particulars of the situation. All I know is I did what I needed to do, like I always do. Okay. Yeah. Well, thank you for your assistance. I, I greatly appreciate it. Yeah, they are uh, kind of a mess without you. I expected that, yes. A but, fun mess, but a mess. Well, it's a good thing that I'm back. We can continue now. And we One can... of them got arrested within an hour of me meeting them. That doesn't surprise me, actually. Was it Riss? No, actually. <laughs> you visibly see Ray like, huh? <laughs> <laughs> no, it was your big friend. Einar got arrested? Yep. Broke into a museum existed. Exhibit. I, I I knew that they got in trouble, but Einar got arrested. What the hell did Einar? I'm going to have to talk to him when I get back. Yep. That would probably be a good idea. Yeah. So let's just, uh, let's make this quick then, so we can head Indeed. back over. So he makes a a bit more small talk as you find an exit from the city, and uh, you step outside. It's uh, relatively early morning. Um, the sun is still rising, um, which means there's a nice kind of cool wind. Um, the sand is cold from the night; hasn't had a chance to absorb much light and therefore much heat yet. You know it's going to start getting hot pretty quickly, but yeah. for the time being, it's it's actually really nice and temperate. It's just a very quiet and serene moment. So, uh, I know you heard about Dashi. Yes, um, you have news from him then, yes. In a matter of speaking... Uh, first off it's important that you know the one that attacked him or the one who coordinated it it isn't anything Kosin had to do with uh, insight check go for it Number 12 Number. probably lost that one too unless he rolls a nat 1 uh, he appears to be telling the truth. Okay. I find that somewhat hard to believe, but at the same time, Kosin didn't strike me as someone who would attempt to murder his competition, especially <laughs> Dashi. Yeah. Yeah, that, uh... <sighs> There's a lot of people out there that do a lot of things. But I thought it was important. You know that one. Oh, well, good. I'm, I'm. I am happy to hear that. Yes. Was that uh, 
Was that everything? No, no. It's a... Uh... <sighs> well. And... Uh... 25 does not hit. Nope. As he takes... Wait. Uh, let me refresh your page. Oh, it just doesn't hit. Yeah, because if you're near <laughs> armor, a 25 misses by one. I have a 27 AC. Right now, it says, my, my screen says a 26. I uh, refresh it. Oh, you don't have the cloak of protection. You, no, you I have it. I have it. You didn't Wait. before. I just equipped it for okay, you. Okay, good. Yeah. So, as he swings, he's going to make a second attack. Okay. It's a 28. Shield. Goes and sends his regards. Roll initiative. (laughs) (laughs) I had Ryan build me a character specifically to counter Ray's. What's that? That's a nice cycle. Oh, no. No way. No, he rolled a five, oh, which wouldn't be very good. But I think uh, Ray is a little shocked, taken aback. <laughs> um. Well, you want to beat this guy on your own, or do you want us to come in and save your ass? How would you I do that? I don't have a way to contact you. I didn't know he was going to take me away from you guys. I wasn't planning on that. <laughs> well, you can yell and scream. Y'all are like a half mile away. Pretty much, yeah. Inside yeah, the city. He, yeah, but I'm sure so there's I, other people. Send? He doesn't have sending. I, only, I have sending. I only have it to Saravina. All right. So, uh, he is going to, as a uh, bonus action. Watch as you accidentally kill this character that you spent so long building up to be invincible. <coughs> which Which one? Yeah. I'm not I mean... sure which one here. <laughs> well, I think she was talking about Ray dying. Uh, he's going to target you with Hexblade's Curse. Shocking. Yep. I, oh, I can't counterspell that, can I? Nope. That's not a, a uh, not a spell ability. Mm-hmm. Um, and then... I'm just looking through his abilities because I was not planning for this to happen tonight. But then everything happened as quickly as it did, and it was just like, okay, we're doing this. Do you remember that thing that you were talking to me about possibly doing with uh, with him? Yeah. Give him to me alive. He will suffer. <laughs> oh, God. That's fine. Um, what you should do is you should run back towards us. All right. I'm, I'm strategizing right now because yep. I wasn't prepared to do this tonight. Uh, so yeah, he's going to, with his action, make two attacks, yeah. both double-handed. Natural 20. Oh, thank God that I went with the adamant. But it is an automatic hit. It is an automatic hit. Yeah. It's just not a critical one. Uh, and so... Pretty much it. <laughs> yeah. He has more health than me, though. Hey, banish him, and then run. <laughs> you take... I don't have banish Uh... Seven slashing damage. Okay. One cold damage. And five psychic damage. Oh, wait, no. Maddening X as a bonus action. Deal plus five psychic. That's a bonus action. Yeah, you, okay. it has to be... Yeah. Okay, so how much was that? Eight? Uh, so that's, yeah, that's just a... Okay, the ward takes it. Have you cast a spell that's... Shield. Activation. That's true. Yep. You typically have to state that you're activating your okay. arcane ward. All right, second it's, attack. It's been a while. <laughs> it's been a while. Uh, that is an that is an eighteen on the die for a twenty-eight. Uh, shield's still shield's up. Shield's up. It doesn't hit. Thirty-two. Shield is not up this turn. Oh, that's oh have we gone around? A separate turn. Okay. Uh, after, that was a surprise round. Oh, that's yeah. right. Um, this is the start of a new round of combat. Uh. 
I'm gonna let him hit me. <laughs> okay. Uh, that is ten slashing damage. Okay, the ward takes that. And three cold damage. So thirteen total there. Eight. So the ward has. Eight. Yep. Five left. All right. Yikes. Uh, your turn. It's my turn. Yep. Oh no. Okay. Um. Shoot. Destroy him. Yeah. Um. Give in to We the must darkness. fight to run away. <laughs> <laughs> I can't do that. I can't do that. But I can do. Yeah, I'll uh, cast haste on myself. It's gonna counterspell that. I'm gonna counterspell this fucking counterspell, bitch. Okay, he's casting it at fifth level though. Okay, you know what? Then you would you know that? No, I wouldn't. Uh, Would I counterspell the counterspell? I probably would. That's probably fourth level. All right, fourth level. Okay, what is this? It's a. You have to make an intelligence check. Uh, let, let me just double double check real quick. Uh, so counterspell, uh, you're casting it with fourth level. Yeah. DC equal, you have to make an ability check using spell. So you make a flat intelligence check. DC 15. Flat intelligence. Ah, oh, that's 10. Do you want 10. Do you want it? Yeah. You, that, Can that, you that's give valid. it to me? Yeah. Oh! Valid. oh! Don't fail me, dice. Failed me. I wasted. Remember, with inspiration, you can take a ten. I can't take a ten. <gasps> yes, then I'm doing that. Oh my gosh! Because that's a ten plus five. It's fifteen. <laughs> ah! I, will, I will allow it. Okay, I'm sorry. I, I forgot about. You. I, I will. I gave Ray a point of inspiration for something you did earlier. Mm-hmm. I'm gonna say because his failed, but so you you had to use that roll because you have to do it before you roll. Mm-hmm. But you can also use yours to yeah. get that. So. Okay. So. It's two spell slots gone. <laughs> yep. Einar yes. and, uh, and Ray have used their inspiration. Okay. I'm hasted. <laughs> yep. You are hasted. Cool. That is your action. That was his reaction. Yep. Bye. I'm going to back up. <laughs> two move. I'm going to back up 70 feet. Okay. And 70 then- feet. I have a oh, yeah. speed of 35 feet. That now. is true, because yes. you got the infiltrator. Yep. That's also one of the reasons why I want it. Okay, and with my second action, uh, firebolt. <laughs> Fair. Roll it. Nice. <laughs> 29. I know that hits. Yeah, that hits. Where is... Yes. I think we'll do... Oh, 10. Nice. Oh. 16. 26. 26 total. Have to 13. Yeah, I know. Because he he's resistant to fire damage. <laughs> Damn it. Yep. I forgot about that. Uh, it is his turn. Yikes. Um, he is going to use a bonus action mm-hmm. to uh, activate Giant's Might. Yep. Uh-oh. And uh, he becomes large. Mm-hmm. Uh... And he's going to move 30 feet towards you. Mm-hmm. Uh, that is not something he can do yet. That was a bonus action. So for his action, he's going to cast Investiture of Wind. Oh, no. <laughs> it's a race. Which that's a... Yeah, no, sorry. He's going to do that before he... Uh, before he um, activates moves. the room. No, he's going to activate the room. Okay. Cast Investiture of Wind. Okay. And then then moves 60 feet. Uh, so he's right up on you. He's 10 feet in front of me, yeah. Behind, well, he's yeah. large. Oh, no. What is his movement speed then? Oh, oh, no. It's, it's more yeah. the space that he occupies. Mm-hmm. So he... Okay, so he's... That's he's his turn, within, though. Yeah, that is his turn. Okay. Yep. Shoot. Um, um, oh. But he is within five feet of you. Okay. Uh, what do I have? What do I have? I have a lot of stuff. I haven't played Ray in a while. Cool. Um, Ray hasn't fought in a while. No, he hasn't. Um, okay, so he's done that. He's done that. 
Ooh! Wait. Oh, sorry. You do take extra damage. So uh, take an extra 10 damage. Because you take an extra 5 because you're the Hexblade's Curse. Ah, uh, yes. Okay. You can use a bonus action to do an additional 5 psychic damage, but you do also just get a take 5 damage. So it's 10 total? Yeah. Okay. Uh, the ward takes 5 of that, and cool. the ward is gone. Got it. Yikes. Okay. Um... Cool. Uh, yeah, we'll do this. Gravity sinkhole. Okay. Uh, <laughs> yeah. So he has to make a constitution saving throw. Constitution saving throw? Yep. Okay. Does his... No. It does I not. It, yeah, doesn't. it doesn't help him with that. Nope. It's strength. That is an eight. That fails. So All this right. is at uh, fifth level. <laughs> okay. Uh, okay. <sighs> One, two. Come on. Wow. You did ask for used all the he four used all the good rolls earlier. Seven. It's improving. Okay. Here, use this one. Eight. Wow. Ten. Ten damage. <laughs> what type? Uh, I think it's force. Cool. He takes the 10. Yeah, it's 10. 10. Maybe? Yeah, 10 force damage. Uh, pulled in a straight line toward the center of the sphere, <laughs> ending in an unoccupied space as close to the center as possible. All right. Where'd you cast it? Uh, behind him so that it pulls him away from me. <laughs> All right, so how long, how wide is radius? It is a 20-foot radius. All right, so, so it moves 20 feet back. 20 feet behind him. Yep. So, so he goes... <laughs> you see his his feet digging into the sand as it sprays up as he's, like, trying to fight it, but is pulled back 20 feet. Yep. Well, this will get the... All right, is that an attention. instantaneous effect or a consistent one? Uh, that's a good question. Uh, on a successful save, the creature takes half as much uh, and isn't pulled. Is Each it creature... creature is What's the duration? Oh, duration? Um, instantaneous. Cool. So it just lasts for that one turn. Okay. Got it. Gotcha. Okay. Um, cool. I'm going to move back 35 feet. Okay. Uh, and for my second action. Yep. Um, so you are now uh, 55 feet away from him. Yep. Firebolt. <laughs> All right. Uh, it's another 20-something. All right. He's 29. going to uh, use his armor of hexes. Yep. That's a three. It hits. Yes. Okay, good. Give me a, give me a good one. Where's my... This is so nervous right now. <laughs> Nine. Nice. Eighteen. Twenty-one. Twenty-one. Half to ten. Okay, I'll take it. All right. I think he's under 100 hit points now. Yeah. Okay, he, good. He most certainly is. All right. He uh, is... And then I'm going to move another 35 feet back for the remainder because I doubled right, my movement so that's... speed. Another 70 feet behind, so, so he's... 60, 90, so you are 90 feet away now. I'm 95 feet away from him. 90 feet away from him, yeah. Yep. And I assume you're moving out of the alleyway or wherever you are. No, they're outside <laughs> in the desert. That's... Oh. Yeah, so I'm so they slowly... They exited the city. I'm slowly moving back towards Mika. And for that turn, I'm going to go, so, this was your plan the whole time. Kosen sent you to take me out. He's 90 feet away. He can't hear you. <laughs> what? He can't He's going, no so, Kosen <laughs> sent you to take me out, huh? Yeah, like that. <laughs> it's only 30 yards. It's not that sure. far. Yeah, it's not that far. You'd be able to yell it. All right. Um, let's see. He's going to... Fly 60 feet towards you. Bonus oh action. Gosh. No, uh, Investiture wins concentration. So he has to make a concentration check. What do you mean? Why would his concentration be gone? Because fly is also concentration. Yeah. Investiture of wind gives him a 60 foot fly speed. Oh, that's right. Shit. <laughs> <laughs> he does have to make a concentration check, though. The uh, first damage yeah. he took was n not more than 10. So it no. was. So bo it's two concentration well, checks, both with the DC of 10. Okay. Because it's half the... Actually, no. Yeah. It's it's half the damage or 10, whichever is higher. And you have advantage on those. Yep. 
First one passes. That's two 18s. Second one passes. Okay. All right. Yeah. He's hard. going to fly uh, 60 feet towards you. Mm. And then he's oh. going to use his Relentless Hex to teleport. Yep. Using his bonus action. There it is. 30 feet. Uh, so he's right in front of you, and he's going to make two attacks. Yep. Uh, that is a 24. Nope. All right. Uh, is there anything that he can do to give him some... <laughs> what? Second yes. attack. I'm so annoyed. 26. No. He's going to action surge. Um, what have I done to myself? <laughs> Something brilliant. <laughs> yep. <sighs> this is the equivalent. I'm trying to think of Marvel with Iron Man. Good thing he is. Good thing he is. That's what's happening. Where he's just in his little shell like, ah. Uh, yep. I need you to make a constitution saving throw. Uh-oh. Nope, that, that fails. That's uh, DC 12. DC 19. Yeah, no, 12. As he casts uh, Negative Energy Flood, you're going to take 5d12 uh, necrotic damage. Dad, gum! Rip. It's 2. 14. 22. Good lord, he's rolling high. Uh, that's a 6, so that makes it 28. 29. That's his last spell slot, though. Nope. No! He has one left, then. Yep. Bye, Dad. Good knowing you. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So you take 29 necrotic damage. Mm-hmm. It is your turn. Okay. Cure wounds. <laughs> okay. And he's going to make an opportunity attack against you. Wait, why? Because he has the Mage Slayer feat. So when I'm a creature a within... Scroll. Huh? I'm using a spell scroll. Doesn't matter. You're still casting the spell, even if it's, through, even if it's from an item. Uh, when a creature within five feet of you casts a spell, you can use your reaction to make a melee weapon attack against the creature. Hang on, that was 29? 29. 29 damage? Yep. Okay. I'm still hasted. Yes. As a Because that would be DC 14. 21. Yeah, you're fine. Um, Another thing, while this is all going on, Russ is just sitting at the table, like, looking at the scorch, and it's like, I wonder what's taking him so long. <laughs> <laughs> all right, so he's making an attack. Mm-hmm. And I was like, we're probably having a mandate. Fifteen. Okay. Oh, oh thank God. Paradise. Uh, <laughs> okay. The so time in the army, whatever it is. That's <laughs> nine healing. Reminiscing old yep. things. I will take it. Who knows? Second action. Yep. Because that was a spell scroll, can mm-hmm. I use the staff? We'll be concerned in a little bit. <clears throat> I don't know that we will. Yeah, that's fine. Okay. Um, I'm going to back up 35 feet. He's already used his Makoto, reaction. That's true. Might. Makoto might. <clears throat> Riss and Einar, I don't think would be Inventory. Using. Where is mm-hmm. it? Step about. We're okay. Good. Well, yeah, and um, Kudo definitely had the wool over our eyes. Like, we didn't trust him 100%, but it was also coming. Yeah. You also never asked. <laughs> yeah, we yeah you never did. He said that he had a message for, for Ray. I never said that he had come from home. Paradise. And well, I implied as the DM that he might have come from Dashi and that that would have been very in character for Dashi. Which it would have been. But I... You must pay very close attention to what I do and do not See, say. <laughs> Einar was never there for that interaction. He learned... That's true! Learned it was just Riss. Afterwards. Yeah. Constitution saving throw. And of yeah. course, Riss never picks up I, on these no. things. No, he does not. He I don't know how many quests then. I've missed. What do you cast? Not only as a player, but also as Riss. Nice. <laughs> uh, Constitution saving throw? That is a, an eight. That fails. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Okay, one, eight, 14. What's the range on Conor Cold? 60 feet. Okay. Cool. That's why I'm only 35 feet back. Yep, that's fine. 30? That's 20. 20? I wish. I know, right? 21. 21. 28. 32. 40. No, 32. 30 plus 7. 39. 39. 39 cold damage. Very nice. And he takes all of that. Yes, he does. Uh. He is not looking too good. All right. How do you Uh, not know he's not doing too good after that? Because I'm hurting. Actually, 
Just one moment. He is going to use a luck point to re-roll that saving throw. Okay. See if he can pass it. What's the DC? 17. Wait, wait, wait. Doesn't he have to say he's going to do that before, like, the outcome or the thing? Results. Yes. Yeah, but he's giving me a couple things. Yeah. And besides, it fails anyway. <laughs> it was more so that I forgot that he had it. It's because I just gave it to him. Yeah. Uh-huh, oh. that's, the, that's the feat you gave him. Wonderful. <laughs> I was going to say, I was like, you never Good used job. a luck point. Nope. Like, I never used the runes either for the four levels in fire yep. he has. Mm-hmm. Mm. Oh, we're in that. Interesting. Yeah. He's 15th yep. level. 16th now. Yeah. yeah. All right. All right. Uh, that's your turn. Uh, and I'm going to move. What? <laughs> I said, and you died? I know. Because you <laughs> yep. sat there and ran away. Yeah. Wait, that's I awesome. Never mind. <laughs> I did this. Yeah, like, okay. I'm going to move back Go. another 35 feet for to end my turn. 70 right, feet how much me. damage was that? That was... <laughs> 39 cold damage. Yep. All right. So he has to make a concentration check. That's a flat 20 that passes. Yep. Oh, so close. <laughs> That's close. Yes, it is. Um, how far away were you to cast Cone of Cold? 35 feet. And then I moved He my... already used his reaction, though. Yeah. Yep. And then I moved right. my uh, additional 35 feet back. All right. So you're... 70 feet away. 70 feet. He's going to fly 60. Yes, he is. So he's within 15 feet of you. Does he have a 15 foot? Oh, no, he's got spells. Shit. Yep. He's got one spell slot left, though. What is he going to use? <gasps> uh, he is going to invoke another rune. That's easy. This is the first rune he's invoking. Uh, the fire rune. As you see, the frost brand in his hand, then a runic symbol glows on it, and it is the sword that looks like it's made of ice is then wreathed in fire. Frostburn. Yeah. A little bit. Fire and ice. Mm-hmm. I had fun making it. Which means his action. Ah, so you're Todoroki. Pretty much, yeah. A little bit. That's very cool. He's Todoroki, but if Todoroki were a barbarian. But he's not really a barbarian. Because he's a warlock. Correct. And a fighter. Yeah. Make a wisdom saving throw. Is he casting a spell? Yes, he is. Okay. I'm going to a counter spell. <laughs> At. Shoot. Uh, I would do like the highest. <laughs> yeah, sixth yeah. level. <laughs> okay. Because I know that's his last spell slot. Didn't use a spell slot. <gasps> Wait, what? That was something he was using his piety for. As he reaches out his blade and just says, Drop. (gasps) As he casts command. Yup. But you counterspell. Yes, I did. Your turn. (laughs) I'm gonna eat this. (laughs) (laughs) Um. Cool. Let me out. Uh, uh. (laughs) Let me out. Let me figure it out. Uh, where is it? Spells. Oh, there's so much stuff on here. So much more than he had. He yep. was so simple. <laughs> Until you went to the feats page. Um. Yeah, sure. Why not? Uh, gravity sinkhole again. So he has to make a Constitution saving throw. Okay. Uh, he's going to use another luck point. Yeah. Why'd I give him that? You fully did this Natural to me. Oh, no! He doesn't even take half damage. Nope. As he just... <laughs> nice try. Cool. Uh, nice try. Uh, fireball. <laughs> Wait. Nope. You used your action. Oh, hasted action. I'm hasted. Mm-hmm. Firebolt. Blade ward, actually. Okay. Interesting. He yeah, doesn't have any spells. Well, he has one spell left, so might as well guard against that. Yep. Nasty looking sword. Yep. Dragon Ward come back up? Or is that gone? It's gone. Okay. I, all the health was yep. eaten, so. I don't know how that's so All right. Okay. So that's your turn? It's okay. Yeah, that's my turn. Uh, moving, how far away is he from me? He was. He was 15 feet from you. Okay. I'm a backup. <laughs> Even further. How close am I to the city at this point? 
it's less so close to the city, more so like, are you going to spend an action trying to open the door? No. Then I don't think you're going for the door. Okay. <laughs> you're just trying to back away. Yep. So seventy. He also back. would have made sure that the city was to his back. Okay. So if you're retreating back from him, you're retreating in into the desert. Okay. So yeah, seventy feet away, full movement. Okay. He's going to fly sixty feet. Yep. So you move you move seventy feet. So you are ninety five feet away. Yep. No, no, eighty five. Okay. Yep. Sixty feet. So he's twenty five feet away. Mm hmm. Bonus action. Bonus action to teleport. teleport right to you. Okay. I'm getting very tired of you running. <clears throat> uh, he switched to his Trey's evil man voice. Yeah, he did. <laughs> he, 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 go for it. What's the... Oh. What? I'm getting very tired of you running. Yeah. I'm getting real tired of there you running. You That's what it is. 21... Like a bunch of bikers psyching themselves out. <laughs> uh, 28. Shield. Shield. <laughs> yep. I have to. Yep. Um. Hello there. All right. <laughs> yep, that's his, that's his turn. That is? Okay. He made two attacks. Yep, okay. Um. All right, let's see. We will do... You know what? It worked. Ooh, I know what I want to do. No, wait, no, I don't. I don't want to do that. Uh, we're going to do Cone of Cold again. Okay. So he has to make a constitution saving throw. Sorry. Yep. Uh, he is right in front of you. <laughs> okay, cool. <laughs> it doesn't do anything to me. It's He's... What are you casting that from? The staff. The staff. Ah. I don't take any damage, do I? No. Uh, but he does have advantage on it because uh, you have advantage from saving throws against spells cast by creatures within five feet of you. The Mage Slayer. Which brings that to an 18. Ah! Oh, he passed, so he takes half damage. Yep. Okay, so. And he is going to make an opportunity attack against you. Okay. One, three, six. That's really impressive. Actually. Ten. Seventeen. It's a 27. Eight. To hit? Mm-hmm. Uh, shield is still up because uh, it's not the end of my turn. Is that the 18. caveat? Mm -hmm. Yep. Okay. 26. 28. 35. 35. 35. Half to... 35. Half to 17. Got it. All right. 17 have so it's DC 10 yeah he passes how's he looking he's not looking great okay but it is his turn and I'm going to back up my oh, full that, 70 feet that's true again. yeah he Does hasn't he been able to land a hit constitution saving throw that's what he just made oh okay yeah in addition advantage uh, that's a warlock feature right there which is he's good. going to fly <laughs> 60 feet towards you <laughs> Getting real tired of this. <laughs> you gotta find a new line, my man. Make a wisdom saving throw. How many times can he cast that? That's uh, five, at least. Oh, my gosh. 21. Passes. <laughs> sit down. He can only use one word. That's true. Fine, sit <laughs> <laughs> Alright, bonus Ray. action though Ray is uh, a stubborn man Very <clears throat> Bonus action He is Going to use second wind Smart Yep Alright, which means he regains Ooh, very nice 14 hit points Alright, you're up Cool Um Let's do... So he's 10 feet in front of me? Uh, yes. Yeah. Okay. 10 feet or 25 feet? 10. 10. Because he can move 60 feet. Ray can move 70. Yeah. Oh, okay. Yep. All right. We'll do Thunder Wave. So he has to make a constitution saving throw. Okay. It's going to be at fourth level. Cool. Uh... 
Uh, that is an eight. Uh, that fails. Yeah. Okay. So, one, nine, 14, 20. 20 thunder damage. 20 thunder damage. All right. Yep. <clears throat> and I'm going to back up. Yep. He passes the uh, con save. You got it. I'm going to back up some more. <clears throat> if you didn't notice, I'm kind of a ranged fighter. And you're a little bit bigger than me. And then I'm going to cast Firebolt. All right. Go yep. for it. Ah, <laughs> oh, yes. Uh, 23. Cool. It's going to use his armor of hexes. Mm -hmm. For a five, it misses. Uh, yep. If he, his, his, uh, his hex to target, if he rolls, he rolls a d6, and if it's a four or higher... The attack misses no matter what the roll was. Oh, wow. Yep. D that, that doesn't apply to natural 20s, though, right? It doesn't. It, regardless of the roll. <gasps> yep. Oh, that's a nice feature. Yep. Fine. He kind of just... There's a slowness to it this time. As he, as he flies 60 feet towards you. Meaning that there's a 20-foot gap between you. Mm-hmm. And a bonus action teleport oh, right up no. next to you. Gave you credit. Made me pull about pull out all the big stops. As you see him, a pair of goggles that is on his head. That he taps and casts anti magic field. Haste, investiture of wind are gone. What about the runes? That's still magic. Everything magic. Oh, I know. All of my my staff. Yep. My armor. Yep. My shield. Mm -hmm. My cape. Describes them as magic. All of it for both of you. Yep. Is gone. Yep. What are you guys gonna do? Fist fight? Yeah. Huh, Ray will lose that. Well, no, you well, your armor Ray, yeah, My armor, armor is magical. But it still exists. Well, no, the augmented armor isn't magical. That's something that I do to it. So it's a full suit of armor that fits. So the armor doesn't go away, it just loses its Is your armor. ability to use heavy armor, regardless of the strength requirement, magical? Um... No, it's a feature of the yeah. subclass. That doesn't give... What? Yes, that gives you proficiency. But heavy armor has a strength requirement that you could ignore because <coughs> of the subclass. Where is it? And for plate, I'm pretty sure it's a 17. Minimum you need. Your metallurgic pursuits have led you to making armor a conduit for your magic. As an action, you can turn a suit of armor you are wearing into arcane armor, providing you have smith's tools in hand. You gain the following benefits while wearing this armor. If the armor, armor normally has a strength requirement, the arcane armor lacks this requirement for you. Adamantine plate has a strength requirement, which you do not meet. And it is not currently functioning as your arcane armor. Your armor class does not change. It's well, your armor class is now an eighteen. <laughs> All that work. <laughs> what? I hate that too because I was gonna wait and save that for like if Riss ever needed to get Ray. <laughs> I do something to Ray. I was like, okay, I'll look for some anti-magic field, and now it has been exposed. Oh, you took everything off. Yep, it's it's all gone. Do I not still have just a flat shield, so a plus two? I mean, yeah, it's a plus two, but you'll have to add that. So add you have that. a 20. Okay. <laughs> okay. Which is still uh, <clears throat> no mean feat. Well, you fight dirty, don't you? I could say the same. I fight smart. All right, whose turn is it? Yours. Mine? What's the range of the anti-magic field? You don't know. <laughs> well. If you would like to use your action to... No. <laughs> You want to wait in there with the fighter? <laughs> no! I'm going to 
Back up. Get around it. Also, you notice his longsword? Uh, it's no longer flaming, nor does it look cold. Oh, wait a second. He doesn't have it at all. No now. longer. It's, it's gone. It's gone. Mm-hmm. <laughs> That's fine. He has other weapons. I know he does. Do you have any other weapons? Yeah, I do. Okay. Can you Your use them? Because he draws out a dagger. Come on, then. Mano e mano. <laughs> you know what's great? It's his dagger is 1d4, right? That's my base uh, on arm strike. It's just yep. a four. Wait, where are my where are my daggers? I thought I had a dagger in my inventory. What happened to it? I don't know. Well, that uh, what what'd you do with it? Didn't you give it to someone? Mm. I'm pretty sure you gave that to Makoto. Oops. Okay, so Oops, the yes, staff of power just know. becomes a regular staff. Yep, it is a. It is a. Uh, I believe it's a quarter staff. Okay, is is can that is that dex based? Pull a Gandalf. No, it's not. With it. It's not. <laughs> yep, that it is beast. just a quarter. So you give yourself just a quarter staff, and that's what a what you're using at the moment. Uh sure. Let's hit with the quarter staff. Yep. You have a plus three to hit. 18. Hits? <laughs> yeah, that hits. Yeah, that's two handed. Like, so. All right. <laughs> two. Also, he is no longer large. Yeah, well, we're literally just fisticuffs at this Oh, yeah, point. absolutely. Because yeah. he has a dagger, mm-hmm. and all of the warlock abilities are now gone. I'm not hexed. Nothing. Mm-hmm. Yep. I, he doesn't do any extra damage. He's poking me with a dagger, and I'm hitting him with a stick. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> Trey, that defines you and me perfectly. <laughs> <laughs> oh, what risk would you give to see this? <laughs> I know. I think I would almost be tempted not to hop in there. I wouldn't let y'all. Oh, um, this is my fight. You you could try. <laughs> yeah. No, the moment that Kudo betrays Einar, and the, if Einar ever found out what Kudo's abilities were, oh no, you would not be able to. Einar would be more willing to kill you, steal his soul, and then resurrect you <laughs> than stay out of it. <laughs> Rispa would have just killed Okay. Kudo. That's my turn. So, you, how much damage did you do? A two. <laughs> Two. Two damage. All right. He's going to make one attack. <laughs> a one. <laughs> a two. Uh, that is a... My phone. Uh, my computer just died. Hang on. <laughs> uh, 22 to hit. Yeah, that hits. 14 on the die. Why are you not bringing a, a two? I I uh, for eight piercing damage. Oh, jeez. Is that maxed? Nope. Uh... One short. I need to figure out if his second attack is magical. It is. It's with the packed weapon. He's not fifth level in fighter. Yeah, you can attack with your packed weapon twice when you take it. Th- yep, this is not his packed weapon. Nope. So he's a dagger. <laughs> uh, you know what? You know what he can do though. What can he do? He can pull a wrist. And, and he's what? going to oh. bonus action. Take out a second dagger. But daggers are light weapons. Mm-hmm. That's right. You can do two weapons. He's going to yep make a second attack. Now, if he doesn't have two weapon fighting, this does not have his modifiers. He does not. So this only does a. This will only do a d4 of damage. Okay. Actually, no. No, no. his his fighting style is dueling, which only applies if he has one weapon in his hand. Yeah. So he's not going to do that actually. Okay. So yeah, that's just that's his turn. <laughs> this is an odd duel. I know. I wasn't. Yeah. I he just stabs this. you. Your turn. Ah, damn it. Um. <laughs> Shit. But I do. Uh, Thank God he did this at the end of the fight. Can you imagine going on 100 hit points with just his quarter staff? And <laughs> um, I'm going to whack him with the staff again, I guess. Yep. It's going to miss. At this point, are you guys concerned at all? Oh, no. Keep I, in mind, I been how long has this been? This has been like a minute. Yeah. So was this your plan the whole time? Just... 
to come over here and take me out. No. Wait, <laughs> what was the plan here? You're, we're, I'm hitting you with a oh, stick. Oh, you think I'm here to take you out? What is your plan? Are you gay? <laughs> Are you gay? <laughs> uh, so you miss? <laughs> yeah, his turn. He's going to make an attack. <laughs> 19 on the die. Oh my gosh. Hey, look, be happy. I know, I'm very happy. Curse is gone. I'm very happy about a lot of things regarding that roll. Uh, you take seven damage. <laughs> I'm here to take you away. Well, let's speed things up real quick. Um, yeah, well, I guess Kosin wants the other half of his soul. Yeah, he does. Your turn. Uh, what? How, so how long has... Because I know the fight's been a minute. How long would they have walked? They've walked for... How's he looking? Like five, ten minutes? Not good. Really? <laughs> yeah, honestly... He's we'll... at like... Yeah, he's real low. Riss and Einar are... <laughs> this is anyone's fight. Yeah. <coughs> Riss, Riss guys... might look up at Makoto and be like, Are you worried at all? <sighs> are you worried, given everything that my dad's wearing now? <laughs> I you son him. of a bitch! <laughs> <laughs> Do you know this Kudo guy? Never heard of him. Eh, okay. He seems cool. <laughs> Your turn, Ray. Okay, <laughs> 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 will go, he died once too, so he can't be that tough to be if you know, they are fighting. <laughs> Why would that even come to mind? So Ray looks at Kudo and goes, so you're content to be a pawn for this Kosin character. I'm intent to get paid. I missed. It's his turn. <laughs> no, that's only a 12. So, so it's a tin can and a guy with a butter knife fighting each other. Yep. A tin can with a stick. <clears throat> that's right. Very true. What did Kosin <laughs> promise you? More than you can. Oh my god, that's a natural one. He's going to make an opportunity attack. <laughs> that's a 21 to hit. Yep. Damn it. <laughs> For six piercing damage. <laughs> I'm officially bloodied. <laughs> okay. He's been bloodied for so better. long. I know. I feel much better now. Yeah. <clears throat> Although I'm starting to get work. She hit is money your rounds. only goal here or is there something deeper? Because someone like you and I can see the scars of war in your body. I'm going to attack him. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> I'm assuming all this is happening while you're attacking Pretty each other. Pretty much, yeah. Uh, that's a 16. Meets a beats. Yes! <laughs> All right. Where did, my, where did my D8 go? <laughs> Please yes. hit him for at least seven. Six. Six, oh, okay. Six damage. Seven on the die. But He's not looking good. <laughs> Just crack him on the side of the neck as, as I say that. And I think you can respect that that comes with a certain amount of respectability for finishing a job. 26. Damn it! No, sorry, 24. Oh. Still mid. Still mid. <laughs> Six damage! <laughs> You're a lucky punk. <sighs> this is genuinely anyone's fight. Even if it means sacrificing everything. Nope. I missed. I'm not sacrificing anything. 17. Can you? Oh, that misses. Yep. Oh! <laughs> uh, also, you don't have your shield up if you're using two hands. Oh, that's right. Well, that's it's an still an 18. Still... Oh, no, I know. But I'm just saying, it's your choice. If you're doing a D8 of damage. Yeah. Um... You drop on the shield? Yeah, I cast the shield off. Yeah. <laughs> I, I assume you did that, like, early yeah. on in the fight. Yeah, okay. Yep. There isn't anything that that would have made the difference on so far. Okay. I'm trying to think here, because... You're giving up on... Riss and Einar. Missed. Make a persuasion check. Woo! And since you missed, you don't have disadvantage. Oh! <gasps> You don't have a modifier, my dude. For persuasion? Yeah, you're right. 18. <laughs> <laughs> for, for a minute, Ryan like, forgot that Ray is not charismatic. Yeah. I was like, we well, all don't have 18. modifiers. You see him pause. Ooh. He's going to attack. Okay. But there was you're impact. Cracking mm. the emotional armor. 
Yep. Uh, d- yep. 16 on the die, plus yeah. 8. Yeah, that... Uh, for seven piercing damage. At least let me say goodbye. <laughs> I know what that life is like. And it's something that I walked away from after losing everything. But in losing, I also gained. And I know Kosen. And he's trying to regain what he's lost. I'm not attacking this round. Make a persuasion check. With advantage. Okay. 17. I don't think you have quite a handle on what Kosen wants as much as you think you do. He is going to attack. Okay. 15. Nope. This is... The rage just kind of put the staff on the ground. Then maybe you should enlighten me and I can see what I can do. This is beyond you, and this is beyond me, what I'm trying to stop. That's the entire purpose, I assume you know, of getting the Black Book. I've honest. never stopped defending people, even after leaving the military. But I stopped being the man that Kosen is. Make a persuasion check. With advantage. Come on. Where is that natural? I know. 14. 14? Mm. Okay. He is going to attack. Okay. He's a man on a mission, but... Can I, can I take the dodge action? You can use your action to make persuasion checks. Okay. The D- That's fine. I'll say this much. You have hit the DC each time. Okay. And it is getting lower okay. every time you succeed. <laughs> <laughs> so it is... At this point, it is a war of attrition in a different direction. <laughs> no kidding. <laughs> it's can you convince him before he kills you. Right? <laughs> he doesn't have advantage on the attack. And yeah, that... It's almost fate because that one also misses. That's only a 13. <laughs> He's rolling lower. <laughs> I don't know much about what you and your friends are doing. I have not been given the particulars. And I don't much care. Mm-hmm. It's your turn. So, what is your goal? What is your Doing objective? the job I was sent to do. And you're satisfied with that? Make a persuasion check. With advantage. 19. He's making an attack. Okay. Natural 20. God. <laughs> so. That's adamantine armor. It's, it's, oh, it's, it's, it's the, double. The adamantine is a type of metal. Doesn't matter. It's a magical metal. <clears throat> uh, it, has yep. a, it has that property. So that's four. Plus five is nine. Mm-hmm. That's eleven piercing damage. What you at? I'm still in double digits. I'm at sixteen. <laughs> what is he at? That's really cool. Fifteen. <laughs> He's been there for a while. <laughs> wow. You are standing there, both of you, completely without magic, bloodied and battered. In the middle of the desert as the sun rises. As much as I want to kill Kosen <laughs> or uh, Kudo, Kudo. I, I am 100% okay if Ray and Kudo walk back in bloody and beaten, <laughs> and Einar just looks at them and so, goes, What the hell happened to you? So you ask, what, what was it you said? It was. Uh, I said, And you're satisfied with that. And he just takes the dagger and rams it underneath a, the, the, the chest plate mm-hmm. and it just it is the first critical hit you've taken in a very long time yes it is and there's Ow. a pain to it especially as it gets close to the previous wound that you have there uh, Ray gasping for the longest time my objective was to finish the mission and when I realized what that cost I had to stop make a persuasion check with advantage 17 okay he's going to make an attack as he just says fight back already it's only a 16 nope 
not everything is solved by fighting. And I think that's a lesson that a lot of people need to learn. Make a persuasion check. Now he says that when his armor isn't working. Yep. <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> 17. Okay. It's making one more. Give me the freaking nat 20! All right. That is a 24. Yeah, that hits. Four. Six. Six piercing damage. You can see his hand is shaking, though. Be honest with yourself. Not to me. Not to Kosen. To yourself. What do you want to do? Make, a persu- make one more persuasion check. Seventeen. That is an eighteen on the die. That hits. As he goes, but as the tip of the dagger barely presses into your skin, drawing blood, he stops. And throws the dagger as far as he can. You see a scatter of sand. You rolled so many 17s. <laughs> yeah, you you were literally like, this was not... <clears throat> this was nigh impossible to do. But you just kept rolling high and just... This well done. Great. This is who he is. And I love this character. Wow. Ray is a lot, like, more good than Einar is. <laughs> Koz, uh, it's not Kozen. Kudo kind of just yeah. kicks, the, kicks the sand at his feet. Just... God damn it. I was prepared for you to be like him. I was prepared for a lot of things. Not. God he kicks more sand. <laughs> There's a lot of things that I've learned about Kosen recently. Who he is. Who I was. If you don't know, he is the other part of me who Dashi made. Yeah, yeah. I know the basics. The difference is that he is desperate to reclaim what he lost because he knows that something is missing. But I'm not. I'm content with the man that I've become. I've gained so much more than I've lost. Kudo is not who you think he is. I mean, you mean Kosen? <laughs> you picked too many K names. This uh, one was, this one was this him. This one was me. Uh, My bad. Because uh, Kudo Baiko, doesn't that mean like traitor? I don't even know. Yes. Kosen is not who you think he is. Yes, when he first started, he was desperate. That's not his goal anymore. Then what is? Well, right now, the thing he's most concerned about is that you're going to get in his way. He's not afraid of you keeping what you have. He's afraid of you take of you taking what he's made for himself. Hmm. He earned that station, at least as far as he's concerned. He had nothing to do with what happened to Dashi. That much is true. He's making very good with the fleet admiral. Is he a good leader? Depends on what criteria you're looking at. Can he rally the troops, make good strategic decisions? Without question. He's a good soldier. Yeah. I'm not sure I would say he's a good man. Apparently. 
Apparently, he tried to reach out to you, and you wouldn't give him a straight answer. Would you? To someone who isn't a good man? I don't know. Fair. We're sitting in the dirt right now, just covered in blood. Oh, yeah. <laughs> you need some milk. milk. <laughs> <laughs> I have no interest in taking what he's built for himself, but if he attempts to expand beyond paradise, I might have something to say about that. <laughs> Maybe. I, I don't, don't know what he's got planned for the future. It's not my concern at the moment. That is good to know. I do know of a way to fuse the soul fragments back together. <laughs> I don't think he's got much interest in that. Well, if he does, there's a way to do that. Yeah. And if he's willing, when I'm done here, I might... Well, I'll say this. For two people who are apparently one, I've never met two people that are more different. I'm not the only one he'll send. I don't think your word is, would ever be enough for him to risk it. Would it be for you? I think the family that I've built can handle themselves. I do. If I certainly else hope so. Yeah. I definitely won't be allowed myself... I definitely will not allow myself to be lured out into the desert again. That's probably a good idea. Yeah. All right. <sighs> well, if anything, you were true to your word. You had a message. And you delivered it. I didn't lie. <sighs> so what is it now? What will you do? Best thing I can do right now. Hide and hope he doesn't find me. I think I have a better idea. You want to turn that thing off? <laughs> then I can't... No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> I do cast... Sending. Yep, I know it. To? Saravina. Yep. You son of a bitch. Hey, hey, Kudo, you want a job? Yeah. Actually, yeah. That's exactly what I'm doing. What do you say? Need medical assistance. And I have another potential crew member for your teams. Or... As you call it, what is it? Uh, a beneficiary? A benefact? Mm. Yeah, a beneficiary. Benefactor? Yeah. Whom you've met. Also, fuck you, Russ. <laughs> right. He's not even there. I know. <laughs> <laughs> it's just a habit at this point. That's at this point, right. yeah. He has four words. <laughs> well, then, that is, uh, you are proving to be quite a worthy investment. That's the only message you get? Maybe I'll leave us alone for a little bit because I just gave him another person to do his dirty work. And uh, It's like a backwards pyramid scheme. Pretty much it. <laughs> <laughs> no, I think it is just a pyramid scheme. A <laughs> 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 human pyramid scheme. I would love to see Kosin go up against Saravina. <laughs> Draw that one out. Yeah. Uh, and a portal opens. Right next to you. Alright. You've met him before. Let's go talk to him and see what he can do for you. Because I can guarantee you he's a much better benefactor than Kosin. And can pay much better. I believe that when I see it, but 
The man has two place. crowns that belong to gods. You don't want to know what Kosen has. Enlighten me. <laughs> <laughs> we'll talk about it later. Damn it. <laughs> and as you step through the portal, which closes behind you, you know, Seravina will be able to get you back to your friends easy enough. But that is where we're going to end tonight's session. Ooh.